Okay, but we are continuing um, our journey for uh, all the bosses with only a torch. I've been thinking of maybe doing like a no hit run with a torch. Wait, let me start the timer again. Okay, so from where we are, we're in Altus Plateau, and uh, I think I think I'm gonna. Hmm. There are a whole bunch of bosses that we can. Oh wait, no. There's a nice cavalry here. I think it is nighttime, right? Uh, it's it's starting to get morning. I'm not sure if I'll be able to kill this um this knight's cavalry here, but I look tan. Yeah, I I actually got a, a bit of a tan because I went to the I actually went to the beach. I never go to the beach. <laughs> Oh shoot, I, I don't know if those guys are going to continue to shoot at me. Alright. Hopefully this guy... ...helps me out here. Okay. I was going to say this shouldn't be too terrible. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen. All right, here we go. So I need him to come, yeah, all the way over here. Because if I stay by um, the road, then all of those other mob enemies are probably gonna like hit me. Oh my God, this is pretty decent damage. So like doing a no hit run like this, I don't think would be too bad. You know what I mean? Although, I, I, you know, I do have all the buffs attached and everything, but Come on, dude. Okay. Okay. This should be pretty decent damage I do here. Yeah. Oops, I didn't have enough stamina. There we go. Easy, dude. <laughs> and we are already on our way to uh, destroy this challenge. All right. 64 bosses, huh? Okay, all right. We're getting there, dude. Call you either? All right, zero. Uh... Early Sunday stream. Yeah, I I just wanted to. I don't. I I felt like having an early stream. I don't know. I, I just I wanted I wanted to do this run because it's it's pretty fun. That's pretty much it. <laughs> uh, let me. I'll fight the falling star beast. I think. I saw dude. What's up, everyone? How you doing, dude? But butters. What's up? Oh wait, I can actually level up. I think. I'm not sure what to level up. I got 40 Vigor, so I should probably go into Intelligence. Now you have Entertainment. I'm your Entertainment! Yeah! <laughs> That's really awesome to hear. I'm glad you like... ...like watching me, you know? Pure Intelligence and Faith. Well, so... There are a couple, um... Wait, did I use the Sentry Torch? I did, right? I think I think it did. Uh, there are a couple of um, uh, torches in this game that don't scale off of like dexterity and strength. Wow, you just you just tear through that guy. That's insane. This guy has to be like resistant to fire or something, right? I would imagine. Not bad damage. Not bad at all. I thought that attack actually came later. I'm terrible.
Okay. Okay. Don't do that to me. Please don't die. Alright. What's up, Hobo? Ooh. I missed. That was a headshot, at least. I am trying to get a stagger, but he keeps on just running away. Ooh. Yeah, I can't really get a stagger on him <clears throat> because, uh, He's way too nimble. Okay. Maybe stagger now? Never mind. Alright, no stagger. Stagger on the last hit. Yeah, thank you. Thank you again. Appreciate it. Uh, uh, Pluto, what's up, dude? Alright, cool. Um, uh, there's a, a grotto here, right? That we can go to. If I'm not mistaken. I think we could probably get over here. What's up, Ver? How you doing? Is it Mason Butterfly? Yeah. I'm doing pretty well. Thank you for, uh, for stopping by today. Hope you're doing alright. Hope you're doing well. You really won the fight, man. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Huh? That's 65 out of 165. Alright, cool. Alright, I have to rest here because I want um, my physic back. It's really nice because you'll never be in the dark in this run. Sometimes it kind of gets annoying. Like you forget to put on your lantern or something and then you have to like equip it, but you always have a torch out. It's like really fun. I think this is the Omen Killer and Miranda fight, right? Woo. Excuse me. Oh, that's not anything that I need. Yeah, those guys can actually tear you up pretty good. <laughs> See ya, pancakes. Doing well, that's good I hear, dude. Thanks for stopping by today. I hope your entire weekend goes very well. Or, hope your entire weekend was very well. Alright. Miranda powder, you say? Alright, let's try it. This is a duo fight. And this actually staggers him. Yeah, that's insane. Oh, he has super armor. Come on. 
There we go. I'm probably getting poisoned here. And that's fine. It does do a lot of damage. Like, it, it isn't too, too bad. Like, it's more than you would expect. But you obviously get more damage from, like, other things. And they have some really good synergy with fighting these flowers for some reason. <laughs> like, they, they light a flame and then, uh... They just kind of stand still. Okay. Uh, that was another one. Where should we go now? There's, um, there is a death bird over here that I can get to. Um, actually, no, I think I already got that one. All right, did I already get the death bird? I did. Oh, shoot. Okay, well, then we can go to, um,. We can actually fight the bell bearing hunter that's right here. Okay, cool. 66 out of 165. Uh, so who was that? That was Omen Killer and Miranda. All right. So I believe you have to. Well, let me level up Oi, first. Where are you right. off to? Uh, Exaurus, thank you for the follow, dude. Welcome in. Okay. Nightfall. And then... I think you just have to rest again, and then it'll... Despawn him? Okay, yeah. So we're good right now. I need this guy to, uh, all the way over here. I, I think we might be good. And we should be in the loop. Elden Ring just kind of froze there for a second. Whew. Okay, I think we're good. And this is it. Hard game. <laughs> you do this with like pretty much any weapon too, so. Yeah. Isn't it a cool loop? I wonder if they ever patch it. I don't think From Software ever really, ever really patches the loops, though. Oh shoot! Ooh. GG. All right, another one. Alright, dude. That's 67. That's the bell bearing hunter, and I can change my title too. Did he really tell me about the loop? I knew someone in chat told me about it, and then, like, I think I. S that's when I first knew that there was a loop. And then, uh. I think I saw someone else do it. I'm like, oh, that's pretty cool. Alright, cool. You did. Well, thank you, I guess. So, what haven't- so we haven't done, uh, this over here. I don't know if I'm counting Mount Gilmere as its own thing. Yeah, I, I guess I should because, like, yeah, I should because it, it, it is its own thing. It's not, it's not just all this plateau. Um, first time I tried, did the explosion. I do remember that. I'm like, oh yeah, shield slam, and then boom. Because he, he can do- the shield slam, if you're in front of him, and if you're behind him and he does a shield slam, then it won't be the explosion. Which is something that is really helpful to know, right? So... Uh, you know what? Let me... I could just go to Worm Face. Or I could fight Lance Axe. You know what? Yeah, let's fight Lance Axe. Just because, um... 
it's gonna be really difficult. <laughs> oh man. Feeling dizzy. Dusty, why why are you feeling dizzy, dude? Um I could get that gold you know, yeah, I'll get the golden seed, why not? Or, no, I'll, I'll get it after I, I kill Lanceax, I think. This will be a really hard fight. Well, it's going to be one of the harder ones. It was one of the harder ones on my um, level 1 playthrough. Uh, level 1 no upgrades. Like, damn, this was difficult. There is a grace here. The skill is dis dizzying. I almost said dizzling. Is dizzle is dizzle a word? For shizzle. Dizzle. Yes, says the person with drizzle in the name. <laughs> Alright, Lance Axe, you idiot. Where are you? Honestly, I think I'm doing about the same amount of damage as... Like, I did with Square Off. Oh yeah, this is bad. If you get caught in the first one, I think it's actually impossible to, uh... Escape the other ones. It is incredibly difficult as well to uh, to stagger these guys because they take like a fraction of the uh, of the poise damage. I think they even take a fraction of the poise damage if you hit their head. I did not know that it started that far away from him. I think all my stagger damage is probably gone. Damn. Damn. It's a Yoshi. That attack really messed me up on my level one. Because it's so terrible. A lot of it, the attacks that he has is really bad. Yeah, like... Gotta be, I gotta... 
take my time here. I got hit by a lightning strike on the craftable material. What hit me? Are you kidding? What hit me? Bro. <laughs> You've got to be kidding. Like, this, this is actually a joke. <laughs> it's actually a joke. How did that not hit him? <laughs> like, come on, dude. You, you gotta... It's just ridiculous, man. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, the yeah, I'm reminded why this fight was so terrible. All right, round two. It should be fine. I think we should be able to. to see that. How'd that miss? Yeah, I, now I'm, I remember that was another reason why this fight was so bad was because the rocks physically prevent you from moving. God, it is a mystery how some of these miss. dog Dude. Oi, are you 
Can you hear the follow him? Bro, hold. <laughs> God, I thought I was going to be here for, I don't know, at least a few more minutes. Jeez, I, I hate that boss. I never want to fight Lance AX, like, ever, in any circumstance. That's how much I hate it. Alright. <laughs> you followed. Um, Alpha Omega and Shoopy Shepard. Thanks for the followers, guys. Appreciate it. Alright, so that's Lance AX. Um... Probably the worst boss in Altus, so I think we're good. You don't want to fight any of the dragons. I mean, yeah, <laughs> pretty much, right? Pretty much. Well, okay, I guess there is... Wait, hold on, let me go back here. There, There is a, um... Uh... Black Knife Assassin here. All right. Um... I'm thinking intelligence. Or just upgrade intelligence and dexterity alongside each other. That, that might be the play, actually, now that I'm thinking about it. Uh, where's the ancient hero's grave? Right here, right in front of me. Alright, so this is a black knife assassin. Hopefully, I don't die. Right? That's right. It has a it has deceptive range. I have to remember that. Yeah, deceptive. Right when I even say it, it's like the deceptive range still gets me. They have they have super armor in that attack. I didn't know. And super armor in that attack, I guess. Come on. Nice. Yeah. There we go. Nice. Uh, yeah, I mean, that attack, it's it's designed to, to be deceptive, right? And, like, 
sometimes I'm okay with attacks like that, but I mean, most of the time, uh, I'm I'm not. It, it's just kind of annoying for the most part. Uh, that one right, and then sixty-nine bosses, by the way. Nice, right? Sixty-nine. No, 68. Wait, what? Am I dumb? Did I miss one? Falling Star Beast, there we go. Yeah, 69 now. Alright, cool. Can I level up? It is very unintuitive, but I mean, it's it's whatever. If you know the attack, then you can deal with it, so I think for the most part it's fine. Alright, um... Hmm, yeah, I just go with dexterity right now. Uh... Which hero's grave is this one? Is this the one where there's, um, the phantoms? Maybe? Yes. Yes, the phantoms are indeed here. to drop down here. This room was a monster when I, uh, was doing level 1 upgrades. Alright, cool. So I believe I have to take care of... the boogeyman here, right? Like texture glitches, I agree. I, they kind of look cool. I do like the the idea of them. One hundred percent. This is more challenging than the other level one all boss run from a few months back. No, not no. It hasn't been more challenging, but I mean, it's much more interesting somehow. <laughs> I don't know. Just the the sole fact that like oh oh. Royal Revenant. Do you still see me? I'm gonna quit out, dude. Alright, cool. Like, I guess I'm... I'm limited in a way that, uh... I wasn't necessarily limited in... The, um... The level 1 no upgrades run. And by limit, I'm limited by the fact that I can only use one move set. The hardest challenge run I've ever successfully completed. Uh, an Elden Ring, or in any Souls game. What is this guy doing? Hello, you're supposed to attack me, you idiot. Wait, why isn't he attacking me? Alright. That was kind of weird. Alright, cool. In Elden Ring, the hardest one that I've done... 
I mean, I feel like by almost pure definition, it would be, uh, I, uh, I bought Elden Ring on a different account, and then I played through it fast enough to get a refund on Steam, and also in doing so, I took no damage. If you type in exclamation point refund in chat, it'll take you to the video. And then in Souls in general, I have... I have no hit Dark Souls 1. Uh, with only the straight sword hilt. All bosses. Oh, you idiot. I guess the good thing with... The Ancient Heroes of Zamor is, um... I do have fire damage. I can't believe that was a stagger. Nice. And thank you for the vault. Appreciate it, dude. All right. Uh, well, the the torch did that much damage to that guy because um. Oh, do I have to? I have to actually do this because he was weak to fire, <laughs> pretty much. Uh, engine hero of Zamora, So we're on seventy bosses. I'm gonna keep the Taito at sixty nine because that's funny. And I'm kind of a memer. Um, I can't remember if there's a boss here. I don't think there is. Wait a minute. No, it's just a... Just the church, okay. Oh, I should go here anyway, because there's, there's a sacred seal. End game with the torch. Yeah, Millennial will probably be uh, noticeably more difficult than the other ones. Although I'm pretty sure she can stagger a bit from the torch, so that might be fine. Ooh. Um also Godskin Duo might be really bad. From what I remember. Uh where am I going, dude? I can I can start going to the uh the lake. Yeah, here. Actually, no, I, I didn't have to go there. I could, I can go to the other shrine, or grace. There we go. Level 1 no-hit-all classes under 24 hours. Well, that'd be impossible, because not all classes start at level 1. Checkmate. But, I mean, it, it, it wouldn't be that bad if, I mean, if I, if I did every class and I allowed myself to use everything, then, um, it would be fine. It, it, would, it wouldn't be that bad at all. <clears throat> oh, I have to fight Wormface. Wormface is so gross. Like, gross because it's, it's so difficult to actually hit him. And the real boss is Death Blight by a thousand percent. Uh, I think this is the perfumer duo, right? And then there's another cave around here that has, um, that has, uh, 
two bosses. One's the Necromancer, one's... I don't know, something else I forgot. Oops. Yeah, I guess the yeah the <laughs> the actual design of the boss too is pretty gross. You are right. That's right. You gotta go down here. Right, yeah, there it is. See, these puzzles aren't too bad once you know. Wait, is this... Oh, there it is. Once you, uh, have already gone through here a couple times. Yes, you can upgrade the torch. And I, I have upgraded the torch to... It's plus 12. Alright. Ooh. Deceptive range. That's a true combo as well. Hey, let's see what's up. So perfumers are annoying because they can practically make it like impossible to uh, get to them without taking damage. Is this a loop? <laughs> Torch OP. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> that was... That was way too funny. Okay. <laughs> Oops. All right. Uh, seventy-one. And perfumer, misbegotten warrior. All right. All right. Okay. But yeah, that's how the torch run is uh, treating me. It's it's going pretty pretty smoothly actually. Um. I actually, I can't get, or I can't remember if there was a different boss over there. I, I doubt it, though. Mm, okay. Uttering bosses essentially uh, have infinite stamina bars compared to the other From Software games. Well, the, the bosses in the other From Software games also do have infinite stamina. Oh, that's not it. Unless you mean like there, there's almost no downtime, then yeah, that's kind of true. They're much more relentless in this game. Like there's much uh, f fewer times that you can actually get hits in. Okay. There's a, there's a room in here that has like a whole bunch of those guys just waiting for you, and it has a whole bunch of um, chests in there too, right? I think it's this. 
And there's a whole bunch of just waiting for you. Jesus, man. <laughs> Uh, you have to bait them into creating the opening to punish rather than it just being there. Uh, kind of. What what the bosses in this game kind of boil down to is, like, if you can stagger them easily, then then it then it's just easy, right? That's why strength weapons are such a meta in this game. It's like if you stagger them, great. Or if you can get like a few single instances of damage on them, then like you're doing solid. Okay. I have to not die. This guy does not stagger is also a thing. Okay, cool. Wrap their talons, huh? So pretty much I didn't need anything that were that was in any of the um chests, right? I doubt these have anything either. Eh, this one looks kinda cool. Wow, an invisible wall. Or an illusory wall. How did I not see that coming? If it wasn't for wild strikes, this guy would have been the most difficult boss on my level 1 plus 0 run. Because look at all these snakes, or look at all the snails. And he constantly, he constantly summons these uh, skulls that do massive damage. And the snails also do just annoying damage and there's so many of them at one point yeah he is the most annoying boss i think not only is he an, an npc but he has so many like yeah he has so many like time wasting moves yeah, this is a really bad boss. <laughs> it's like... What do you do, right? Yeah, I started stream like a couple hours early. What is up? Idiot, I mean tag. Hi tag, how you doing? Oi, where are you off to? Uh, Matias, thank you for the follow, dude. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> people, what the fuck? What do you mean, people? What the fuck? You're, you're a... What the fuck, dude? I might not use a rune arc because I don't think this is gonna go down very well. What a wicked tan, bro. It's a lot better than me being, like, super pale in my mic or in my cam. That's what I really hated. Look at my runes. And he has hyper armor through his attack. Oh man. This really is a special kind of like terrible boss fight, I think. Like there's nothing else like it.
Nope. So I believe now there's more snails? No? That's right, the snails can... <laughs> the snails can shoot skulls at you too. I forgot about that. One more skull for good measure, right? <laughs> just, just one more. Alright, well then, I'll... Runark. Greetings from Argentina. Well, what's up, Matias? How is it in Argentina? You know what I can do, actually? I could... I can quit out and just get more HP. I don't have to use, um... I don't have to use a flask for this. Oh, and I, I could also use the Sentry Torch as well, right? Do I have a... A Somber 5? I do. Oh shoot. Okay, wait, never mind. Let me. Uh, yeah, let me upgrade this since I already, I already used the rune arc, so. End the raffle? Oh yeah. Do I have a mod that can do that? See, I would do it myself, but. I mean, look at me. I'm. I'm stupid. Now I do it, actually. <laughs> And VIP raffle is paused. You're welcome, chat, for preserving the sanctity of the VIP raffle. Am I too much on DS2 or is the torch unlimited duration? It is unlimited in this game. Uh, it's any torch, MVB, any torch. Uh, Shrinkman, Sentry Torch. And back to Altus. This one right here. Yeah. yeah, there's two bosses in that cave. There are a couple um dungeons or caves or whatever that have two bosses. It's like two or three, I think. Whose wicked emote is that? Oh, it's yours. <laughs> it's Really cute. I've never played DS2, but I've heard people say the Scala Edition ruins it and to go vanilla. Uh, people say either one. I, I've, I've heard the same thing about both of them. I have the most experience on Scala the first sin, however, I have not played the DLC. So don't, don't take my word for like anything in that game. Yeah, DSU is the only one with, with limited torches. Where are you? Here you go. You are a tank. Nice, first try. First try, dude. Uh, where else do we go? Uh, I guess down to Worm Face. Get all the achievements on OG Dude. Uh, you haven't gotten to Scholar for Sin yet. I, 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 I never really cared for the achievements, to be honest. Wait, uh, that was Necromancer Garrus and. 
Black Knife Assassin. So we're at 73. 73? Very nice. Oh, I can uh, level up here. You liked the original, you're on Scholar, and oh my god, frick Iron Keep OMG. <laughs> but yeah, the the uh, the Doll Ember in Scholar is in a much more convenient place. You can actually use it, you know, without killing half the bosses. Been a minute since I could catch stream. Hope you are doing well in chat. I am doing very well, Chico. How you doing? Welcome back. Welcome back. All right. Were you a customer? No. So like. Yeah, honestly, though, I should probably buy these um stone sword keys. Whenever I see him. So I think I'll... Mm, I don't know if I should fight Wormface first, or... God's gonna puzzle. I'll go for Wormface. Oh, that was the last time we caught? Yeah, dude, my time with Kitty was amazing. She's back in Spain now, though. I think she left uh, a couple weeks ago. the right, right? This is where Warm Face is. Okay. Yeah, that's right. This is what made it kind of infuriating as well. There's these ads here that are stupid. I'm gonna quit out and quit or load back in because that'll save me on my flasks. I'm gonna rank up in COD. Wait, what? My guy, what are you talking about? Just kidding? Oh, I'm like. Ooh. Was I, like, hacked or something? <laughs> Oi, where are you up to? Uh, not John, thanks for the follow. Ooh. Oh no. So, where was the death blight? I didn't even see it, where was it? There was no death blight around me. Like, I was, I was elevated up, like, I, I'm really confused. Interesting. Yeah, these guys are really annoying, too. Alright, cool. How many bosses you've missed after 200 plus hours in Elbury? Oh yeah, 200 plus hours, you're not gonna get to all the bosses. Trust me, dude. Oh, shoot. That's right, that's the AoE. The most difficult thing in this fight is just hitting him while trying to somehow uh, not get death blight. Like, where is the death blight, right? 
Like, if you're going to make Death Blight be dark and yellow, why would you put this boss in a dark and yellow place? <laughs> there we go. Yeah, he's pretty unfun. I, I don't like him either. <laughs> Thank you for the follow, though, dude. Uh, not June. Appreciate it, dude. All right, there we go. 74 bosses. And... Warm face. Are we at 74? Yep, 74. All right, God's an Apostle next. Uh, There is a, a golden seed here, right? Nice. I don't I don't know if there's a a grace up here. It take Deathblight over the curse BS? What curse BS? In like the other games? Like I mean Deathblight is is cursed without the the like humanity penalty because there is no humanity in this game. Which yeah, I guess I guess it's kinda the same, but like I I don't think it's good. <laughs> Here it is. Ah, DS1, okay. I mean... I guess it's pretty bad, but... You don't really run into curse... I guess you don't You don't run into Deathblight either. Too much in this game. But where you run into curse in DS1, it isn't too bad. From what I remember. Okay. I'm not sure how long this is going to take, so I'm not going to rune arc here. Because I, I will probably die. Input reading idiot. It was fine. Yeah. Want to keep up the stagger? Damn. Tabasco. I thought he was an animation cancel. stopped. That's pretty wild. Okay. 
What I miss, dude? What? Nice. I hate this boss, dude. Okay. You still panic every time Melanie does waterfowl? Yeah, I think everyone does, don't worry. <laughs> I do too. I'm like, oh, am I gonna dodge it correctly this time or am I going to die? To, you know, two hits of them. Tune in next time. All right, 75. Uh, so we have the Crystallians, Elmer, Bird Tree Burial Watchdog, Sanguine Noble, Stone Digger Troll, and Tibby Mariner. So, Tibby Mariner is over here, right? Let's go fight the Mariner. <laughs> Tag, don't you like it? Uh, there's also very few places uh, to get purging stones when you're actually cursed. That's true, I mean, but like you... You would most likely already have visited the places where you would... Like, need the purging stones. Right? Because Oswald... Gets you absolved of curse, and then uh, if you get cursed by Seath, then the clams drop the purging stones. Red, thank you for the follow, dude. Welcome in. Hope you're doing all right today. Oh wow, the boss fight already starts. Days. Where did he go? It's kind of a bit of damage, huh? not too bad huh yeah torch hard carrying me right now <laughs> maybe I should attempt a torch only no hit run because from the looks of it it won't be like as bad as I thought it would uh, I think it's over here right yeah, here it is Okay, so that is uh, Tibby Mariner and 76 bosses. Yeah, maybe I actually do another no hit run, huh? Wouldn't that be insane? Uh, okay. Yeah, I remembered, like, isn't there a trap here? And, yeah, sure enough. This is the one that you have to go under the elevator, right? No. no hit torch. Oops. All room bears. Dog.
Okay. This has a false uh, elevator in it. Yeah. What's up, Black? How you doing? Did I take the wrong turn here? I feel like I did. I am doing pretty well. Thank you for asking, dude. Oh, shoot, I forgot. I have to actually climb the ladder. Don't send me all the way back down. Oh, okay, alright. saw nothing that blow dude that blown dude don't hit me don't hit me don't do it don't hit me all right we're good I think, um... I really don't want to die too much because um, I don't want to run out of rune arcs. What is that slime even holding on to? It's just, just floating in the air. back up here, right? Uh, let's quit out again. I want to be full health for this. I actually forgot what boss was here. I guess I quit out one more time. Yeah, why not? Get the full health. The Elden Ring Molecule. A mysterious substance capable of many things some would deem supernatural. Oh. The the slime, that's what you're talking about. backwards on that. I guess I've never actually had to actually fight this guy. I think even in my level 1 run, he... he wasn't too bad. Very cool. 
Easy, dude. Uh, who else is there? And we have one, two, three, four, five, six more bosses, and one of them is here, uh, and one of them is also like right here. So, okay. Others would deem them bad hitboxes. <laughs> GG, thank you. Appreciate it. So I think Stone Digger Troll is um in that one. I'm not sure if there are any other bosses in this basin. I can't really remember. I also don't know if I want to um, count Landell as Altus Plateau. Probably should, right? I guess I don't have to. I think I can level up with these uh, runes. I have 30k. Okay. This still has C scaling and ducks. Yep. All right. make all these guys hate me this is where the um yeah i probably should have killed that guy uh wait what's this way oh this is the end oh my god that's right stormville castle is limgrave yeah, true. Oh, this isn't the, the troll. This is the, uh... Oh. Alright, yeah, cool beans. Really hard game, dude. This is con considered a striking weapon, so like, I'm doing regular damage to them. Stagger. Yeah. Easy. Nice. Easy peasy, dude. Um, so that would be the Crystallians. So that is 78 bosses. And I forgot to update it. Oops. Okay. Sanguine Noble is over here. And I think taking this teleporter takes me to the other side of the bridge, right? Yeah. Uh, Ulcerated Tree Spirit in Stormvale does not have a, uh, boss health bar. I believe that's death. Let me get this. Uh, Mood, what's up, dude? Welcome in, dude. How are you doing today? Uh, wait, where's the... 
left right here. But I, I mean, don't worry. There's there's a whole bunch of ulcerated tree spirits in this game that are bosses. It kind of got annoying after a while when you uh, have to fight so many of them. It, it's pretty. It's pretty dumb. Uh, I don't think this guy should be too overbearing. I believe you get lead if you step in that, right? In this stance, he can parry you, I think. Oops. I was trying to see if I can stun lock him with our ones. Alright, nice. Easy, dude. G. Okay, so Sanguine Noble. 79. Alright. We're gaming, dude. We're cruising by all these bosses. Wait, that's a oh no, that's a that's a tower. I'm like, that's a is that an Everjail? It's <laughs> confused for a bit. Um, where are the other bosses, actually? I, I don't remember right now. Oh, Elmer is in Shaded Castle, I know that, and then... Where is Stone Digger Troll? Is it right here? Wait a minute. Oh, so much harder than knowing as a mob. Yeah, when there's multiple of them, then they're they're really bad. Because if you have multiple things like being thrown at you and then like they're all causing bleed build up, it, it's really bad. Don't die. Oh, well, it didn't die. Hey, Monocles. Thanks and good luck, dude. Mm. No, it isn't over here, is it? Is it? Wait, is it up here? I uh, think is a hot take to say that the bell-bearing hunters are harder for it less than ulcerated. No. Uh, I say that because um, there is a loop that you can do for the bell-bearing hunters. Where's Stone Digger Troll? Old Altus. Oh, it's on the way to Shaded Castle. I remember now. I remember now. But yeah, for Hitless, it, it it's easier to fight the um. The bell bearing, bell bearing hunters because uh, you can loop them. 
Just get behind them. They'll use their uh, shield slam attack. And then you, um... You roll through it. Attack them while you're behind them. And then they'll do the shield slam attack again. And then just keep on doing that. You can do it with any weapon too, I'm pretty sure. Oh, come on, dude. lesser versions there's a rot tree spirit in uh i think that there's multiple rot um tree spirit bosses the one that you enter through radon's arena that's a rot tree spirit and it's a boss who is this damn did he really just blow up his entire crew yeah he did Um, okay, what was the way to get through here? These tunnels always have me turned around. Free smithing stones. I love it. Okay, so it is not up here where I have to go. Dog. I'm gonna have to ask you to calm down. <laughs> Yo, what's up, Zucks? <laughs> oh my gosh. I need these guys to get out of the... Wh like, okay, so why why do enemies just non-stop attack when when they're right next to you? Like, they, they don't stop moving, right? But when, when you want them to get out of a extremely inconvenient spawn, they, they just take their time. Like, th there's no way their AI is that advanced. Absurdity, dude. Boom. Uh, let's heal up the fall. These guys have just zero poise, and it's funny. <laughs> My dear God. What if I do this? Hold on. <laughs> Alright, cool. Oh. That was one more. And that gives us... 80. Nice. Why you hurt the troll he, he only want happy? Then why was he trying to kill me? We're almost halfway there. He for he for gore Snickers bar. He shut up for gore, dude.
Okay. Um. If I can rem remember, like, the fastest way to get through here, that'd be really nice. Fucking Zux, dude. Zux is like, yo, you know what's gonna just make the whole chat die of laughter? Corn. Oh, fuck you, dude. Yep. <laughs> yep, corn. That's corn, butters. That is corn. What do you mean, dab? <laughs> uh, hmm. America runs on corn. I thought America ran on Duncan. Oh, yeah, there it is. <laughs> I believe you get hit here. Yeah, that thing comes right after you. Dunk corn donuts. <sighs> Dunkin' corn nuts. <laughs> That thing has a has a curve to it, dude. Corn and donuts. Oh no, I just got annihilated in the face. Oh, Lele. Ah. Sorry. Don't, don't thanks to the dollar, dude. Corn. 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 Beans. Thank you, Monocles. Dang it, dude. Bro. Nice. Easy peasy. Ah! Um. Don't, oh, don't panic, what, thank, thank you, monocles. Flour. This yeah, sweet cornbread recipe starts with a cup of all-purpose flour. <sighs> Middle yes. dot cornmeal. Mm -hmm. Opt for yellow cornmeal for this recipe, as it's sweeter mm -hmm. than its white counterpart. Middle dot sugar. Use two-thirds cup white sugar okay. for the perfect amount of sweetness. Uh, thank you, Monocles, for the, for the 
with the rest of it. Thank you, dude. <laughs> Thanks for the treaty, Zuzzy. Um... See, I'm not sure if I want to, um... Fine. Fight in so Caleb first. Baking powder, baking powder acts as a leavener, which means it helps the cornbread rise. Middle dot salt, a teaspoon of salt enhances the flavors of the other ingredients. Oi, where are you off to? Handle, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. And <laughs> Monocles, thanks for the dollar donation again. Thanks for the dollar donation again. <laughs> milk, use whole milk, 2% milk, or your favorite alternative milk to add moisture and help create the perfect batter consistency. Middle mm -hmm. dot oil, a neutral oil, such as vegetable oil, keeps yeah, the cornbread nice and moist. Moist. Thank you, Monocles. Alright, so, um... Double Crucible Knight is pretty, um... Oh, hi, Bear. Double Crucible Knight is pretty, uh... Wacky, right? Um... I mean, hopefully I don't really run into too many problems, but I probably will. actually can. Um, more decks, because why not? Alright, so what are the... Tor I, have the th I have three torches so far, and there are, I think, six? Yeah, so the beast repellent torch is something that I don't really need. That's the other, like, physical torch, and then there's the ghost flame torch and St. Trina's. Okay, so we're, we're on the right track here. Monocles again with the middle the dot egg. One egg lends moisture and acts as a binding agent. Mm -hmm. Vertical bayou underscore comma vertical bayou underscore vertical bayou underscore comma vertical bar vertical bayou underscore <laughs> comma vertical bayou underscore vertical bayou underscore vertical bayou underscore comma vertical bayou underscore vertical bayou underscore comma vertical bar vertical bayou underscore comma vertical bayou underscore vertical bayou underscore vertical bayou underscore comma vertical bayou underscore vertical bayou underscore I'm so proud of this community vertical bayou underscore comma vertical bayou underscore vertical bayou underscore vertical bayou underscore comma vertical bayou underscore vertical bayou underscore comma vertical bar vertical bayou underscore comma vertical bayou underscore vertical bayou underscore vertical bayou underscore comma vertical bayou underscore Vertical bar you underscore comma vertical bar vertical bar you underscore comma vertical bar you underscore vertical bar you underscore mm -hmm. one quintillion nine hundred and thirty quadrillion four hundred and ninety two trillion seven hundred and eighteen billion four hundred and ninety four million twenty thousand one hundred and eighty two corn. Wow, that, bro, that was so interesting. I was happy that happened. What even is it? You know, you know, just... You know, dude. Don't worry about it. God, I find that so funny. You could just crouch past that guy. <laughs> Thank you, Monocles. Appreciate it, dude. What's up, Kindred? How you doing, dude? Alright. I can... Make a pro gamer move here. Oh. Oh, I can get hit once. That's actually really good.
All right, yeah. I get the crucible tether, crucible feather talisman, just because I can, I guess. Yeah, the damage isn't that bad. It's just it's kind of short range, and uh, I I'm limited to just one move set all the time. guy. Wait, does he actually... Yeah, he's fire this way. What's up, trophy? Wait, did I just... Oh. I guess that was kind of worth it because the tree set in the armor is really good and if I ever like absolutely need it it wouldn't be that bad to put on you cannot add ashes of war to the torch no unfortunately I only have, um, uh, shoot. I want, I want all of the, I want all the flasks that I can get. Okay. How many, uh, I have, I have three golden seeds, which means, wait, I would only need one more. To, yeah, whatever. Seven days from Butters, fourteen days from Pluto, one month from Lizzie, <laughs> one month, four days, rather. I'm not sure who has the longest watch time on my channel. Yeah, four months sub, so if you're watching me for it was seven days, right? So seven times 24, that's like uh, 184 hours, 182 hours. Yeah, that's quite a bit. Blaze, you think so? Let's go. Mm, Ozzy doesn't exist. Oh, never mind. Two months from Ozzy. Wrapping it strong. Oi, where are you off to? Uh, gamer, thanks for the follow, dude. Two. Thought that it, that was gonna hit me. If I'm being real. 
Alright. Way too early of a roll. Nice. That's right, you can't really roll into it. Yeah, that was gonna be sword to the face. Can't really be moving back if you're gonna jump that. Oops, my bad. Didn't even train. I'm a terrible gamer. There we go. Okay, we have one more boss before we go into Landau, actually. Uh, yeah, can go here. Yeah, GG. It is pretty decent damage. I mean, yeah. <laughs> have fun, uh... Have fun doing that yourself, I guess, right? <laughs> okay. I think that is enough to level up. So this is a Grave Order and Duelist in uh, this dungeon. <laughs> oh, that is a Rune Bear. Yeet skirt, dude. You would never dare to try, now you could try. Give it a try. You got it. I believe in you. I have to get another golden seed. I'm the only one. Okay. Uh, oh, I forgot which ones, like, have the... Like, the real... Oh, this is the stupid... Like, gaslighting one? Okay.
Uh, God, for the life of me, I don't even remember what I was supposed to do. Yes. I think it's this one. And then you have to go to the one on the side. And then you're going to be in the right spot. Right, because if I go this way, I think, yeah. Oh, okay, whatever. Yeah, so this isn't really the right place, right? So we gotta go over here. And then I think it's this one. No, is it the other one? Wait a second. I like how I can just see nothing. That's really good. Oh, all right, yeah, cool. So I do remember. He's not coming. Mm. Where are you? This way. Uh, this is the duelist, right? I don't really know what, like, knowing what the boss is going to do for me, but I mean, I guess it makes me mentally prepared. Yeah, I guess. Oh, jeez. Seven? Nice. Second. There we go. And this should be GG. Nice. Just how they all spontaneously combust, so it was pretty funny. Alright. Well, that's it. Time to go into uh, in the lane now, dude. GG's. That is 83 bosses thus far. All right, okay. Uh, who's all here? There's Morgot, there's um, Moog, and what's his face? Godfrey Spirit and the Fell Twins. Those are the ones that I have to fight. Yeah, we're officially more than halfway. Nice, dude. Didn't really take too much time at all. What's the level am I at? I am at, um... 73. You have to scrub the Moog one? 
Oh, oh, no, no, no. You're talking about, um... Esker. As yeah, yeah, I, I know which one you're talking about. You finish a Star Wars movie marathon besides Solo, and your ranking is... Uh, five, four, rogue one, eight, three, seven, six, nine, two, one. That isn't too bad of a, of a ranking, I would say. Although I haven't, I haven't seen... Four, five, and six. Or I haven't seen four in a long time. I haven't seen five and six. Yeah, it's Priest of Blood. His, his name is Esker. Esger. However you pronounce it. Maybe that bad is your ranking? I mean, yeah, if you say so, Ozzy. Papela. I'm surprised Rogue One is so high. Rogue One, it's just, it's, it's like a... It's like a... Like, if you told someone that a Star Wars movie was just directed by America... We need help. Yeah, a lot of people don't like uh The Last Jedi. For the life of me, I, I can never understand why they think the things that they say is wrong with it is wrong with it. You know? Edgar Esker, whatever. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah, I should probably. Uh, you, actually, you can't fight Moog yet. Oh, you can actually. Never mind. Oh, damn it. I don't like going in the sewers. Without Assassin's Gambit, it's just kind of like, bleh. Why? They trash Luke's character? I, see, I don't even see that. Like, a whole bunch of people always say that, and I, I, I didn't see it at all. I have a friend who's on TikTok who's a big movie guy and he always posts about The Last Jedi and Ryan Johnson. He he always just he rebuts everything that people have wrong with The Last Jedi all the time and people hate him for it. Yeah, it is after Moog's passage, right? That's what I thought of right when I said it. You are correct. Should I get the, uh... My, uh, actually, I don't think I actually need the virtual shield talisman. How do you see the light in someone that has killed thousands? Oh, you mean the, the guy, his own father, who he actually tried to, to kill? And then he didn't actually try to kill... What's his face? Uh, Kylo Ren? You mean like that? I love how simple this boss fight is. Like, there's no shtick to it. He doesn't have an undodgeable attack. It's just a dance. And I love it. 
And as I say that, he's just dead. All right, cool. He spared his dad? No, he considered killing his dad. He actually fought his dad. His dad died as a result of, of, of you know, the, everything that transpired. He held his lightsaber up to Kylo Ren. He's like, you know what? Maybe not. And then he put it away. <laughs> right? Like, maybe I'm out and out. Maybe, maybe I'm actually the one who doesn't understand. The secret was just not it. I liked, um... How's number seven? Uh... What the hell is it? Uh, not... I, I like seven and eight. Nine is terrible. Yeah, I would agree with Ozzy on that one. You respect a man who gargles down some... milk. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Get away, thank you. Uh, Morgoth will be You're not really interesting, but I, I, I don't really like this fight. To be, to be honest, right? To be TBH. Oh, I actually forgot to. Upgrade the boss number. There we go. I went the wrong way on that one. Oops, my bad. Left around him, not not to the right, CBD. Go left. Try it again, huh? Nice. Nice, dude. Uh, Fershito, dude, thanks for the four month sub. Welcome back, dude. How are you doing? It's called a hot take for a reason to say the sequels were good. I don't really think so. I think there's a, there's a there's a really loud minority of just general people. Maybe the people who consider them to be like Star Wars fans don't like the sequels, but like it it is very difficult for me to 
look at that in a really serious way like when people say that the real star wars fans by say that they like less star wars it kind of gets nowhere you know hey silent what's up dude they're in a real star wars sense yeah but like what i'm saying is like some people actually believe in that you know uh, what else am i going to be leveling up honestly just vigor at this point i don't really need anything else um we want to go to um Moog. What's the other boss? Felt wins, that's right. Okay, I guess we can go just down into the uh into the sewers. I mean like I I get some of the criticisms for eight, but like I'm I'm in the same boat as you, Ozzy. Like when I came out of eight, I'm like, yeah, that was really good. And then people started saying, like, oh my god, it was terrible. And I was really confused. I've seen so many Star Wars uh The Last Jedi hate videos that make points that are like they're so nonsensical, I, I don't even know if they're being serious. I don't say a Star Wars is a favorite movie. I wouldn't. Not by a long shot. You see my stats, yeah. Clip it, clip it, clip. Actually, wait. I guess the the chat's in the way. Hold on, let me uh, let me disable chat, and then you can see it. There you go. Those are my stats. That mad wreck. How you doing? There we go. Clip it if you didn't catch it. Um, may I confess that I never watch anything related to Star Wars? I'm 33 years old, and every time I decide to start watching, I find that different people suggest different order, and I just don't start. Just start from when they came out, to be honest. I think if you start from older to newest, I think that'd be probably the way to go. That's, that's my, uh, that's my point of view. Biggest problem with 8 is it changes the way hyperspace works. Now there's no reason for any Death Star would have been uh, defeated. Just make an unarmed, unmanned hyperspace missile. No, but then that is a critique of, of the previous movies, right? Like, like they, they, when, okay, so for example, why couldn't Han Solo go into hyper speed, whatever, when they were in the asteroid belt? Right? Someone actually answered this for me. I, I, I can't remember if it was a... Uh, but I remember it being... about critique of the previous movies but it can go both ways can't it no because just because just because a, a movie in in the later parts of the series reveals that something was wrong with the previous movies that means they're revealing that something was wrong with the previous movies that the previous movies didn't address this now very obvious like problem that that they didn't address right like i've i've spoken about this before and so many people have tried to tell me that like because there was no mention about it in in the previous uh movies and you just have to assume that it's impossible it's like what well, then then you're just saying that you, you just can't have logic in movies like in certain points it, 
It's your take of episode E completely fucking up existing canon. Like, why is there conventional space combat with blasters? So, okay, okay. So can you tell me why no one ever rammed a, a light speed vehicle into the Death Star? Why didn't they do it? If, if, if the original movies were so logical, th then why didn't they do it? What was the reason? There has to be some reason, right? And if if someone can tell me the reason, well then then I I will completely disengage in this and always say that episode eight messed up. But like, but like, w what was the reason for not just hyper speeding into uh, the Death Star? Isn't that the whole point of an interesting plot? It's like saying Ant Man can't go up Thanos. Says, no, no, because. Like, it- well, okay, when, when it comes to Ant-Man going up Thanos' butt, that, I would think that's a bit different. Like, like, obviously you'd have to get Ant-Man there, and then that could- that could be explained away like, oh, like, I don't know, Thanos has extra neurons in his- in his butt or something, and like, oh, there we go, y you can't do it, right? But when it comes to just, like, all you have to do is literally put it into hyperdrive and aim it at something, what is stopping you? Like, like the force? <laughs> <laughs> is it the force? <laughs> hey John, what's up? I feel like I'm uh, out of the loop with Star Wars as well. I mean, I really remember the older movies playing in the background in childhood. Yeah, I, I I never really grew up with Star Wars, so it doesn't really have too much of an attachment for me. Spe speeding regulations. <laughs> uh, sir, we can't go that fast. We are going to get fined, actually. Uh, so we got to slow down. we got to shoot them instead. <laughs> oh, man. Um, you know what? Let me go through here first, and then I'll come back. Was it this way? No, it was this way. Wait. Uh, oh yeah, it is this way. There should be a guy that tries to backstab me, yeah. Why do they have, like, infinite poise? There's two options for why we haven't seen hyperspace warfare in previous movies. There's a reason it's impossible that we haven't been told. Like what? <laughs> or it's possible everyone's a complete fucking dumbass because not one single person before Holdo thought of it. Yeah, so so that would be a critique of the previous movies. So what is the possible reason? Like, is it the force? Well, then, that would be, then that's just all the Jedis are just really like, oh, you, you, you can't do it. They're mind controlling everyone. Like, that would be kind of silly. That jar just died? I guess it did. Episode 8 implies the ladder, which is stupid. So, no, but no, it isn't stupid. If you're going to say it's stupid, then it's stupid for for the previous movies to not have caught that. Th that is a criticism of that one. Is Torn a magic cow or a, a duplicorn? Oh, jeez, hold on. Let me make the poll. I don't know if I have mods here. Do poll. Magic cow duplicorn. Ten minutes. Uh, Josh Brolin was training for Ant Man going up his ass a while back, so I guess that's canon. What?
Alright. Oh, he is heavily fire resistant. Oh my. Yeah, this might take a while, huh? That's right, you can't punish that. Why am I still going for that R1? Oh boy. He's an angry elf dude. Would you look at that? He's just chilling. Oh, never mind. <laughs> He's just chilling again. Nice. Woo. First try. Okay. <sighs> How many movies do you need to count as a franchise? Two? Thanks for the duties, guys. I would say two. Probably. Hey, Doug, by the way. Doug! Voice crack, by the way. Uh, let me see. 86, right? That's 86. Alright, there's Esker that I have to fight, and then I'll fight the, the Omen twins. What a mess, I guess. Well done, thank you. I appreciate that. He had to catch his breath. Oh, that's why he <laughs> was, uh, was...
standing there. Wait, did you ask what's Cloverfield, Ozzy? Cloverfield is that movie um, where people were feeling motion sickness in the theaters when it came out. It's a found footage uh, monster movie. And then 10 Cloverfield Lane is supposedly in the same universe, uh, which is a really good movie. And then the Cloverfield Paradox is a movie about a group of astronauts on an international space station who like discover a wormhole or something and it's terrible i've i've god that movie sucks it's so bad okay Cranko was good. Josh Trank hasn't directed anything good since then though, right? It's kind of unfortunate. I've never seen Wreck. I don't like the Blair Witch Project though. Oh, this is another one of the uh, gaslighting dungeons, right? Actually, leave this guy up. Nothing's in there. I feel satisfying to put the lobsters to sleep. <laughs> it is kind of funny. I've not seen incantation. Planning on watching the new Transformers coming out. Um, no, not really. I, I haven't really seen the other ones. I don't, I don't especially like the Transformers movies. Granted, uh, okay, I I haven't seen uh, the third one or the fourth one or the fifth one. I've only seen the first one, Revenge of the Fallen, and Bumblebee. And Revenge of the Fallen, or sorry, Bumblebee and the first one are, are, are pretty good. And Magic Cow won that poll. Yeah, nice. GG's. GG's Magic Cow. Would have been cool to get the Beast Repellent Torch, huh? In this fight. Can you power sense two different fist weapons? No, I don't think you can actually.
Ooh. Oh my. My oh my. Uh, I guess to be fair, if it if it was just Esker here, it wouldn't really be that good of a fight. It is pretty bad though. I didn't realize he cast it a third time. That's so dumb. Oh, jeez. Just time waste after time waste. Wasn't running for some reason. What on earth? How is that not a trade? What? Am I high, dude? Must be high, right? Alright, cool. <laughs> awesome. Uh, is Fire Breath ever, ever useful? It kind of is. Uh, I might have been able to use it there, but... I, I don't know. It's pretty... Um, situational, I would say. Alright, I think I could just... Leave, right? Yeah, okay. Transformers 27, Rise of the Revenge of the Planet of the Cars. <laughs> Sub's nice. I remember there was a meme. It was Rise Oi, of the Dawn of the Video Game of the Movie of the Planet of the Apes. The Game. The Movie. <laughs> Uh, Juan Taka, thanks for the follow, dude. Uh, Transformers 30, Sam Witwicky re will return to buy a house that will find uh, that it too is a Transformer. Nice. You cannot power stance two torches now. That is uh, not possible. I can prove it to you, I guess. So if you press L1 like that, then you start blocking. I mean, okay, you can kind of power stance it, I guess, because if you do L2, then you attack like that, but that's all it is. So it's kind of a yes, kind of a no. Um... What am I, uh, putting on here? I guess that one. Isn't a Transformers movie uh, where the toasters turn into Transformers? Uh, I know in Transformers 1, the AllSpark starts turning random machines in the Transformers. Like it turns someone's uh, steering wheel into a transformer, it turns an Xbox into a transformer, it turns a, a vending machine into a transformer, and it starts like 
shooting Mountain Dew at people. <laughs> yeah, that was fun. That was fun. They turned a steering wheel into a transformer. I saw it with my own two eyes. Okay, so there's two ways for me to, to go about this next boss. It's either I kind of break the rule of region lock by a tad. Dog. Alright, well, I guess I just have to kill it again. Is that the homie? Sir Passion, how you doing? They turned a 79 Camaro into a modded one. I mean, yeah. That happens, dude. Dude, like, <laughs> how does that, how does that even work? Yeah, you told me. Maybe I should call you Dev then. Wait, what smithing stone? This drops a, a six smithing stone, right? Go that way. No, no, you... Oh, my God. <sighs> okay, all right. You ready for this? About to ruin your whole career. Like, how does that still get me? Thank you. <sighs> Fucking hate this game. <laughs> Stupid. Yeah, GG. Um, I think I'm gonna... Hmm... I'm gonna... Maybe, um, go to Caleb so that I can get the sentry torch, not sentry torch, the, uh, the ghost flame torch sooner rather than later. Yeah, now it was fun talking about movies. Gog and John. Thank you, June. I appreciate it. Have a good rest of your day, dude. Took like more tries in Moog. Yeah, ain't that the truth, huh? Okay, so I want to see what that does to you. I mean, that does decent damage. And it staggers him. Although he does have hyper armor with some attacks.
Oh, Jesus. That's right, he has hyper armor on that. Oh. Nope. I think this guy hits harder than him. Oh, I guess. God, that's so... That's such a fast attack. It's really hard to react to. Oh, too early. Oh, he just has more HP. Now that I'm looking at it. Oh, nice. Okay. Stagger? Come on. Nice, all right. Yeah, that's probably like a one shot or something. From what I remember. If that wouldn't have killed him, I would have died. <laughs> that's pretty funny. <laughs> well, alright, that's Lando. And that is everything in, uh... That's everything in Altus. 88 so far, nice. Yeah, Monkass. <laughs> Thanks to the GGs, guys, I appreciate it. Thanks everyone who's here watching right now, by the way. If you're just chilling, like, thank you for... Deciding to spend your Sunday with me, or I guess Monday if you're in another part of the world. Okay, um... Hmm... Where do I want to go? Caled, right? Let's go to Caled. Uh, or Mount Gelmir. No, Caled. Because if I go to Mount Gelmir, then I'd have to fight, uh, uh, what's-his-face? Record? Uh, yeah, that's good. Me, you just got here. I mean, yeah, you're watching, right? Appreciate you choosing to click on my stream. Actually, let me go to the round table. I'm gonna upgrade my, my torch. No, 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 no. Uh, yeah. 
I need a smithing stone five. Where are the regular bell bearings again? There's only two that you can get before laying down, right? So, no, uh, whatever. All right, back here. Actually, I can buy uh, some rune arcs too. Oh yeah. Oi, where are you off to? Where are you off to? Uh, WMH, thanks for the fall. Welcome in, guy. Alright. Wouldn't it be awkward if I just saw like a tibia mariner like to my left? <laughs> yeah, I didn't actually kill him. That'd be pretty funny. Uh, should I get the... Nah, never mind. I was gonna get the, uh, the stamina talisman, but... You have to waste the stone sword key for that. Hmm. How many hours do you play this game? Um... a good question i i have quite a bit of hours i, I have over probably 1500 1500 hours on this game i think it's hard to tell because i play a lot of my uh games offline nice Uh, yeah, I get these guys too. I don't have the crafting kit yet though, so maybe it's not even that much of an issue. I don't know what I would craft. But only have to craft like supporting items. Like I'm not even sure if I'm gonna be using sleep pots for Godskin Duo. Alright, so for Caleb, um Well, I guess there aren't that many... <clears throat> aren't that many difficult bosses. Uh, I'll go fight Magma Worm first. I played for 9 hours and 19 minutes. Yeah, that's how many. If you want to get a rough estimate of how... Uh, much I played Elden Ring, go to twitchtracker.com and type in my name. The hours under Elden Ring will, uh, give you a general idea. Smithing sounds you get here. Fours? Do you get fives at all? I'm playing really well, thank you. Good. Although I'm just trying to look for <laughs> smithing stones here. Tell me this is a five right now. <sighs> it is not. 
Ooh, a gold foot though. Oh shoot. This one? No. Damn. No smithing sound five in there. I feel like there's a bug in my back, dude. Uh, I think the sentry torch would be the best thing here because it doesn't have, um... It has very minimal fire damage, it has more... holy damage? Yeah, there we go. Let's get it. What's up, Gad? See you. See you, Gad. Ah, yes. Is that it? One more in you? No, I'm good. That was miles too early. What am I doing? There we go. Nice. GG, Magwon. Idiot. All right. Uh, so we are in, we're in Caleb now. Magma worm, where are you? There you are. So we have uh, we have eighty nine. Eighty nine. Yay! We're doing it. If it was for the charge plan, that would be a great boss. Yeah, the, yeah. The charge attack is really kind of weird. Just because I mean, like, I don't know, dude. Why? Why have it? And the entire, like, body becomes a hitbox, too, which is kind of annoying. Wish your flame got bigger as you upgraded it. That would be really good. <laughs> kind of like in, in Dark Souls 1, when when you uh, kindle the flame, every five... No. Every, yeah, every kindle, it, it increases the, uh, the flame of the bonfire. Pumpkin heads, right? We got pumpkin heads here. These guys were terrible on my level one no upgrades playthrough. Hopefully they're not too bad.
One more? Nice. Easy peasy, dude. Hi, crybaby dude. Crybaby bald dude. <laughs> How you doing, double, double negative? What's up, dude? Uh, 90. Freaking 90. Uh, Mad Pumpkin heads. Alright. Um, there is an Urchery avatar over here, and then I can... I could fight the uh, Urchery burial watchdog watchdogs, too. Got the acronym wrong. Oh, common mistake. Don't worry about it, bitch. I mean, sorry. I got the... Got the name wrong. They were Lovecraftian Nightmare? What did they change in terms of... Like, patches that affected them? I've been doing pretty well. Thank you for asking, dude. I'm insane. I am insane. I can't believe I just killed one of the easiest bosses in the game. <laughs> Alright. 91. And Erdtree Avatar. Alright. Uh, the AI just for- oh, uh, did that apply to them? I mean, I guess it kind of did. In that fight, you could kind of see that it did. Now that you're saying something. Charge attack, dexterity, wait, do I want fire? Yeah, honestly, I feel like just having more fire damage would be better, right? I guess I could see. Is the torch scale with strength and dex? Uh, it depends on, um, on the torch. The regular torch has a uh, D scaling, I think, in both strength and dex. The steel wire torch has a D scaling in strength and a C scaling in, uh, it's a C scaling in dex. Um, the sentry torch has, I think it's like a D scaling in, uh, strength and like a C scaling in faith. Uh, the Ghost Flame Torch has, I think, a C-scaling in intelligence. But yeah, they're, they're pretty goofy. I could check them again, but I don't have the Ghost Flame Torch yet, so... Or the Sentry Torch, or not Sentry, uh... St. Trina's Torch. I don't have that one yet. You guys gotta calm down, alright? Uh... Okay. Oh, so I took... an unnecessary turn, is what you're saying? Dog. Is it this one? No. Is this not the... This isn't the, the dungeon, okay. Oh, it was right in front of me, Jesus. Am I gonna die? I might die. <laughs> Easy. E 
to see. Yeah, thank you. Where is this head up to? Oh, wait, no. It's gotta go back down. Alright. Yeah, imps are really bad. I mean, they're just like, uh, what do you call it? Um, what are they called? Uh, the DS3 enemies. I hate these guys. Brawls, yeah. Looks like my, uh... My stagger's probably all gone now. Oh no. Like, I'm just trying to... I'm trying to not die here. <laughs> he doesn't give a fuck. <laughs> I'm just trying to stagger you, man. Alright, whatever. <laughs> Not the best, uh... fight I've ever had, but I didn't die, so... Suck it. <laughs> What's up, Breeds? <laughs> Triple bosses? Should I do double bosses with a torch? <laughs> Wouldn't that be great, huh? <laughs> uh, don't give me ideas now that I'm, I'm thinking about it. Double bosses? Yeah, maybe? We'll see. Thanks <laughs> uh, to the GG's though. Um, I can, I can level up. Uh, yeah, there's more vigor to be honest. So those were Earth Tree Burial Watchdogs. 92. 92. 92 bosses. Triple Rot Crystal Dudes. Oh yeah. Uh, uh, what do you call an, a group of nine? A, a non... Nonet? Okay. What's the next boss? Isn't there like a Oh yeah, there's a there's a cave over here. I go and fight Radon eventually too. Hmm. <clears throat> Is it not here? Did I get mistaken? No, yeah, it's over here. Bob Saget, dude. I guess I could go and fight Commander Nile. Not Nile, O'Neill. Yeah, the Spear Crystallian is really frustrating. Just the relentless attack of stupidity. Uh, 
Um, I have to go down there. Oh, Bob Saget, dude. Um, I've completely forgotten how to go through this, uh, dungeon. I do know that it is a puzzle, but I, I forgot how the puzzle was. My favorite DS3 boss? Uh, probably Champ Gundir. There's this Champ Gundir, but Twin Princes, Cinder, Gale, and Pa- Actually, not, not Champ Gundir, it's, it's Cinder. <laughs> I don't know why I'd, I'd, I don't know why I said jump in here. Yeah, it's Cinder for me. Gale's a pretty cool and flashy boss. Um, Twin Princes I kind of like too, but like the fight would be so much better if there wasn't any furniture in the, in the room. But besides that, I, I, I like that fight a lot. Um, oh, this way? Can you open it from this way? Yeah, I gotta go around. Yeah. Frida was your favorite. You died looking at her beauty. You right there, dude? <laughs> Wait, can I open this? My lever does open that, though. Right. Okay, yeah, I think this is the right direction. Well, if the Pontiff clone didn't desync, then I think it would be fine. But it can desync and, um, and the fight becomes inconsistent when that works. Oh, these guys are all poisoned. I don't know what this gives me. Oh. I don't think I, I even need that, though. Okay, I think I go to the left here, and then we get to the duelist. I like where the desyncs. Well, it mainly only happens because you can parry Pontiff in either of the phases, but... Sometimes when you go for a parry, the clone will desync and it'll do a um, an AOE attack, which I hate. Okay. Uh, duelist dude should be okay, hopefully. I wonder if he will. That does not stagger him, so... Stagger? Nice. Easy. Easy, easy, easy. I forgot what this item was. Oh. Gotcha. Okay. Um, we can fight, like, we can fight the dragon, we can fight, uh, the death bird, we can, like, do anything we want, huh? Oh, I should probably fight Commander O'Neill. 
Uh, okay. Um, and there's a falling star beast. I remember that. Yeah, the phase three fake out is what gets a lot of people for Frito. I think I, I I didn't personally see it, but I think I heard someone talking about man versus game or something was stuck on Frida phase two for like hours and hours and hours and then he finally beat phase two. He got the the slab. He was so happy and then phase three. <laughs> Oh, man. Where's my achievement? <laughs> the the thing that really sells it is you getting the slab, I think. Do you have anything that I want? Uh, yeah, I'll get these. You know, now that I'm thinking about it, I'm surprised they didn't add a Scarlet Rot Torch. Like, you would think that would be something that they would add. Yeah, after second phase, you get, um... You get a, a Titanite Slab. But you're like, oh my god, yes, that was insane. And then she just gets right back up. I had it spoiled for me, so I, I never had that experience. But. Okay, I was thinking about this. I, I don't know if I should cheese this guy. I, mean, I guess I'll try to see. I mean... Die from random arrows. I must have poise broken when he had infinite poise. Yeah, I gotta run away. You know, I'll kill these guys. GG? No? There we go. Awesome. 
It is it. Now we got Commander Standard. Uh, Awaken, thank you for the follow, dude. Welcome in. Playing DS2 the first time, and uh, is it just me or our bosses in that game kind of uninteresting? They, they're they pretty uninteresting. You're not alone in that thinking. I mean, I mean, some people really like the game, don't get me wrong. I'm not going to just sit here and say that it's obvious that it is uh, uninteresting, but there are quite a bit of people who share the same sentiment. I don't want to get invaded by Melison, so I kind of went around purposefully there. Fire bounce off the wall a single time. I don't think fire really bounces off walls in the other Souls games. I think that's a thing that's exclusive to Elden Ring for some reason. Like, sliding off walls, okay, that makes sense in a... But I don't know how you can do that in a physics engine. But having it, like, ricochet, like it does in Fire Giants Arena for some weird, stupid reason is, is really bad. What's up, Jackie? How you doing? Here. Yeah, I gotta run away. Dude, what? GG. Okay. Damn, dude. It's almost like I know what I'm doing. Ah, uh, Naza, what's up? Uh, hold on, let me, um, let me count that, right? Zykes, so we've got 94 bosses so far. We are coming up on, uh, quite a bit of bosses, so. You know what, let me go back to the, the, uh, the grace, god. Can't think of basic, uh, words. Uh, back here, right? Oh no, there's a closer one. Is there actually no? I don't know. I forgot. Okay. Zero seconds watching me. Oh, I see. Oh, gypsy. Okay, gotcha. 
No, it's it's if you change your name, then it uh it resets. Twenty six day from twenty six days. Excuse me from AC. Dur. All right, come on, dude. Oh, jeez. Okay. Should do a lot of damage. There we go. One more jumping attack should be enough to kill. You input reading asshole. Oh, Jesus. I'm going to rip your throat apart. Oh my gosh. So you guys sent to the 15 months, dude. There we go. God, I hate Knight's Cavalry. They're terrible. Uh, dude, tear gas, thank you for the 15 months. How are you been? Thank you for the over year support. Jeez. Uh, it, it says he's. they're not watching me now because I think it goes up in like increments of five minutes or something. I think. It's either five or 10 minutes. How's Torch only going? It's going fantastic. It's so fun. Like, kicking things' asses with a torch. <laughs> it's great. Yes. Right as I say that, I have to fight a death right there. He's tanky. Won't be able to stagger him anymore, but I mean, yeah, I tried. Nice, nice, dude. Uh, see, Esther, flame got me strength. Yeah, I guess I could use flame got me strength, but. Would it really be that much of a difference? I don't know. Anyway, death right bird. Oh, and commander only. Oops. So we're at ninety six instead. 
Um. Oh, and Knights Cavalry. <laughs> wait, wait a minute. <laughs> We're at 97. Yeah, my bad. Uh, so we can do... Okay, we have to do Crucible Knight Misbegotten after Radon. And... Oh, the Tree Spirit is considered Dragon Bear. That's kind of weird. Okay. Uh, well then I can fight the Cemetery Shade now, and then the Nox duo. Let's the GG's everyone. I hate you birds, but no one loves you. Playing. Wait. It's not the right way to go, right? Yes, yeah, this way. For role playing purposes, to do the full Johnny Storm cosplay. Yeah, I guess. I mean, I could pick it up. Ugh, but then, technically, I would be. Um, I'd be using something else. I'd be using a, a seal. Can't be doing that. So this is a cemetery shade, or a cemetery shade dungeon. I hate these things. At least I think it is, right? Yeah, it has to be. Hey, yo, it's a Miranda. It's this one, right? That's what it is, all right. I'm still getting rot? Why? Well, that's funny. Yeah, I know I rolled, but it, I thought it doesn't typically go that, uh, that long. These things are pretty much glass cannons, right? to tickle you for a bit. There we go. Oh, if you change armor, it goes away. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. Alright, uh, Nox Duo? Nox Duo? Maybe, maybe, maybe? And then we can, uh... I'll probably do the Falling Star Beast. Uh, soon after. Oh, you're asking. Oh, I have no idea. Uh, where's the, um, oh, it's over here. Okay. 
I don't want to do that. Uh, yeah, just more HP. It's fine. Yeah, I really don't need any of the secret things that's, uh, that's here. So I'm just gonna go for the ones that really matter. So I believe this tower unlocks the, uh, I believe it unlocks that one, right? Try to head. Yeah. Oh yeah, like, I mean, I think that's just by its nature. Like, if it has so many things, then there will be so many things to complain about. <laughs> that's how it is. Okay. Wow. These guys input read, so like, if you try to do a square off on them or something, then they will... They will show you who's boss. But I guess... Jumping straight in their face... Uh... Is too strong for them? <laughs> I wouldn't put it past Miyazaki to just put things in for people to, to uh, complain about. Would not put it past him. Okay. Uh, Falling Star Beast. Which, if I'm being totally honest, I... I forgot where, um, where he's located, so I'm just gonna- actually, no, I do remember where he's located. Never mind, what am I doing? I, I just gotta go... It's here, right? Uh, here. Okay. Rotten straight. That's where the rotten dogs are, huh? I'm going to have to remember that. Because I don't know where any uh, spirit ash summons are. Except for the obvious ones. Here it is. Uh, yeah, I guess so. I get this, uh, Grace. We only have 66 more bosses, though. Damn. And we've only killed three remembrances. Let's see. You can kill the majority of the bosses in this game before you kill the majority of the, uh, remembrances. It might be very obvious, but I think it's pretty cool. Uh, I gotta go this way. Oh, yeah, you gotta jump across. And, yeah. Over here. <sighs> I missed it. Wouldn't surprise me if Miyazaki explicitly said, and make X thing frustrating. Oh, yeah, probably. I wouldn't doubt it for a second. Oh, please don't hit me off. Thank you. Take the ladder, thank you. Ooh, what is this? Somber four. <sighs> 
Nice. Oh, there's no splitting stones over there. That's a ripoff. This is the worst thing ever, and then <laughs> cleared it for <a> release. <laughs> Uh, oh, how did I miss that? How did I miss it? So now we should go fight Radon. So I guess technically I'm clearing out all the Kalid bosses first. And then I'll go to Dragon Barrel. Actually, wait, now that I'm looking at this, I should probably um I should probably get the Somber 7 that's in the underground here. I think there's a Somber 7 here. He described it as an acquired taste. What, the game or Gideon? Oh wait, I can just go over here. Sorry, I, I cracked my neck. Wait, that's not where I want. This one? Sir Gideon? Okay. <laughs> I'm sure half light is an acquired taste as well. Oh yeah, you wait. I get it. <laughs> Hi, logic. Uh, okay, back to here. We're going to Verdun. It's Mod and Beast Monday. On a Sunday? I mean, it's Monday for somebody. So, yeah, I got you. Could, you could say that. Uh, this way, right? Yeah. It's 1.30 a.m. there, so it's Monday. No, uh It It is 7.26 p.m. for me on a Sunday. Fucking idiots in chat, I swear. Bro, this is a good time for me to drop my YouTube channel. Go to my YouTube channel, subscribe. Like the video, do do all that stuff. Like like my most recent videos. I I think they're great. I think all my videos are great, dude. Fuck you, YouTube. <laughs> Pretty much, right? Yeah, I live Oi, in Hawaii, correct? Where are you off to? Uh, Kajith, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. How are you today? Monday afternoon here, imagine being in the past. Monday after- oh, you're in Australia or New Zealand, huh? Or I guess somewhere in Asia. Shh, 
champions. Welcome. It's a waffle. The stars of a line. The, the best festival the best is nine. Before we begin. Before we begin. All right. Uh, this actually is a, a smithing sound six, a somber six, somber five. So I have, I have access to all the sombers so far, right? Yeah, yeah, one, two, three, four I have from EG and then I've got five, six, seven, eight, and then there's a nine. There's, there's another eight in Dragon Barrow, and there's another, or there's a nine in Dragon Barrow, too, so. Here we go, dude. Hey, Nojo. Yeah, I like the cutscenes, too. They're they're really cool. I'm not one for, uh, for lore, though, in these games. All right. I wonder how this is going to go. Let's go. I could cheese him off the cliff. Uh, some torches are regular. I think two of the torches are regular, and then the other four are somber. Oh, yikes. I am cheesing the hell out of Redon. Can't pay me enough to to fight him in phase two. Oh no! I can't cheese him. too early. Oh, man. How did that not hit me? I haven't fought him legitimately like that in quite some time, so that was kind of a brush, uh, a brush, <laughs> a breath of fresh air. All right, that was cool. One hundred. That was our hundredth boss. Oh, wait, hundred first. Okay, never mind. I'm. I can't count. I can't keep up. <laughs> never mind. Yeah, hundred first. What's up, Sarah? Thanks for the GGs, guys. I British 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 British
Um. It's begun. Wall two finger. Wall two. Kind of like a cranberry with three year subscription to my channel. He was subscribed to me back when I was that cool black dude and he expected me of being a troll. <laughs> Uh, you made look Radam look stupid. Oh yeah, dude, because he is. Haven't played Metal Gear Solid Four yet. I probably should at some point. I've never played a Metal Gear Solid game. Sorry for anyone who, uh, I don't know, really wants me to play it. I'm not having sex with you right now, Walton. Hi, Goss. Oh, Alright, cool. Um You have to fight the misbegotten warrior before you fight uh the Crucible Knight, right? In other words, the misbegotten is first. Or so I remember. Yeah, okay. I believe I could just do this. Oh, shoot. Hold on. Wait, do I have the Sentry Torch? I have the Sentry Torch. Finally, holy cow. So... Jeez, uh, whatever. I was just trying to get the regular torch out, man. And he just kept on coming at me, dude. Alright, try it again. Washed your mom. Alright. Just do what you twerp. Expected that. Wow, it's almost like I would have been able to be in a good position if there wasn't like something in the environment there that was stopping me. Wow. Or it's almost like you, you can artificially inflate the difficulty sometimes. Tail. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Hi, right, cool. Oh, where's my runes? They're right here. Thank you. Choo-choo's. Alright, um... That's everything in Caleb. Well... The Caleb part of Caleb. And then we have, uh... We have Dragon Barrow now. Alright, okay. GG's. 
If you jump on the wooden platform on the left, the Crucible Knight starts to jump on and off. Oh, that one? Happy laugh. Didn't need it. <laughs> L plus ratio plus didn't need it plus... Crucible Knight's bad. Okay. Who am I fighting? I'm just better. Pretty much. Uh, Wait, where do I want to go? Uh, you know what? Let me go, um... Fight, fight the clean rot knights. I mean, Crucible Knights are pretty hard. They are difficult enemies, right? It's just when you play this game for a lot, you, uh... You kind of make them your bitch, right? So... Okay. I do have the Scarlet Rot boluses, so I think we should be okay. Oh, I don't have a dagger though. Oh, uh, wait. No, I do. No, wait, I don't. I don't have the claws either. Oh, uh, shit. That kind of sucks. Damn, I was thinking about getting the misery cord as well earlier, but I should have gotten it. Use parry strats when fighting Crucible Knight. Yeah. Pretty fun to parry. Uh, is it up here? Yeah. Home dog. These guys do not stagger for anything. Oh, except for that, I guess. Should I put that on? Oh, it's a talisman. Never mind. I'm stupid. <laughs> uh, okay, where are we going? Um, I guess back here. What's up, LLT? How you doing, dude? Uh, 103, huh? So, clean rat knights, right? There we go. Am I overleveled or is the torch actually good? <laughs> um, uh... 
what do you mean by over leveled? Because the torch is plus 14, and I have 35 dexterity and 30 and or 30 strength. 20 strength? I'm just that good, dude. Maybe I have food. I do want some food right now. I might be able to... Actually, I don't know if I'll be able to complete this. Uh, this stream. I would like to, but I, I just... I don't know how long it'll actually take. So I think you have to buy something, or you have to at least talk to uh, the merchant before this happens. How can I? Um, I get the beast repellent torch, but I don't really need it. And pop one of this. Wait, get fifty victor first. And then this should spawn the bell bearing hunter. Yeah, there it is. Drink up. Hammer time. Jeez, this guy's a tank. Box much? <laughs> Bro, his his shield attack was already done. <laughs> and it still hit me. Alright. Damn. It's pretty rare that I that I've died to a boss. Hey, what? Oh, I have to rest again? Okay, press again, huh? Here we go. Yeah, I have to stop rolling that so early. Ah, oh, jeez. Oh, because I get hit by the really super delayed, really super delayed attack. You hate every boss. I hate a lot of bosses in this game too. Don't worry about it. It's kind of a sad realization, like whenever um, whenever uh, you start to realize, like, oh wow, yeah, a lot of these bosses I, I just don't like. Maybe try. No, hey, don't don't. Don't, don't be backseating, man. I, I didn't ask for any backseating. What the heck? <laughs> Oops. Alright, here we go. I actually have to heal up again. Nice. And this is the loop, if I can keep him in the loop.
Do the shield attack. Do the shield attack. Thank you. Yes. So that is more than one charge R2. There's 11 more damage. Nice, nice. Okay. Uh, I think it counts it for runs that uh, have a lot of deaths. Oh, the death counter? Yeah, I, I, I've only really died about... Yeah, I mean, like, between 10 and 20 times. Um, and honestly, just yeah, you know, just pump vigor more. I guess I don't really care. Okay. This will give me... this is a somber 8, right? I guess I could just kill you here. Oh, you idiot. There we go. Then somber 9 down here. And that's really good. Uh, we can go back to... Or we can go to Necron and then... Oh, we have to fight the stupid... Um, Gargoyles. I might fight the guards, um... Or I might go to Necron... Later? I don't know. Yeah, I mean, yeah, you have to find them out anyway, but I'm... I just want to get the Ghost Flame Torch. That's the only thing that I want. Um, so, I don't know. I don't know if I want to, like, you know, upgrade my torch more before I fight Garg. I mean, it, it probably won't be that bad. Because all it is down in the Kron is uh, just Regal Ancestral Spirit. Um, real ancestral spirit and mimic tear and garg. So, why am I here? Wait a minute. Let me get the map. Oh, I can also go and fight the the rot uh, tree spirit. I think I'll fight the first Garg first, or the Black Blade Kindred. And then... Or not Black Blade Kindred, um, Erd Tree Avatar, and then I'll make my way to Grey Ill, and then Black Blade Kindred. No, I wasn't really worried about that. 
it's just, uh, okay, so, like, if I go here, I don't have a bell bearing yet. Or, I don't have the, the third bell bearing yet. I think I can only upgrade my torch, like, one more time. Oh. Three more times. Okay, plus 17. That was really good. Never mind. Stand corrected. <clears throat> Dude, I really want to play Elden Ring, but like, I don't know. I shouldn't. I should be giving away my ideas for videos or like ideas for runs. I gotta keep those in myself. I was just about to give away a million dollar idea. to spam this, yeah. I was saying, man, you are spamming that way more than usual. And you're probably dead. There we go. Easy peasy, man. Alright. I actually have to knock off two bosses here, right? Future Avatar. So we have 105 bosses done. God, we're zipping through these. I love it. The torch in this game... It really feels like the broken straight sword in the other games. Ain't that kind of weird? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, you guys can also check which bosses I've completed by uh, clicking that link in chat. Super simple. Is it nighttime? Yeah, it is. Oh, wait, let me, let me rest here. Need my physic back. Oh, I need, I could actually level up. Or I can just be like, hey, I'm gonna beat this boss and not worry about level up. Yeah, Soldier of Godric is, is too hard. I need like a, a plus 10 or a plus 25 torch. Probably get like 99 strength or something too. Dude. Oh, wow. And... Is the horse gonna die yet? No, no, not yet. Whiff City, man. Bro, where are you going? Ugh. That's a lingering hitbox.
He is tanky. That is gross. Nice. Easy peasy. Uh, where's Blue Dancer? Where are you? Hey, we're so new here. What is the hardest Elden Ring challenge run you've done? Uh, someone just asked this question <laughs> uh, a couple hours ago. Um, I think I said there's a YouTube video on my channel. Um, I bought Elden Ring on a different account. I, uh, well, okay, okay, double enemies is probably, level one double enemies is probably, like, the hardest, I think. I, I was level one, and I killed all the Remembrance bosses, uh, but they were doubled. No one else has ever done that before. People have done double enemies or triple enemies or, like, five-time enemies, but they've never been level one before, and that was ridiculously hard. It, it, because, like, most things just one-shot you, at right? And when you're going up against two things that can one-shot you, it, it was ridiculous. But the coolest one that I've done is I, I bought Elden Ring on a different Steam account. And I beat it uh, fast enough to get a refund, but I also did it by taking no damage. And you can look that up on my YouTube. Or just type in exclamation point refund in my chat. The, uh, the link will show up, too. Okay. Um, wait, what, what's the, uh, what's the scaling on this? It's, it's C, and then this one is C in strength. I'll probably never use a piece of bow and torch, to be honest. I mean, I can. Wait, I wonder if it's better. It doesn't have a fire breather attack, though. I mean, I can see. You know, let me... Let me upgrade Beast Repellent Torch later, I guess. Hmm. I might stick with the Steel Wire. I'm crazy for double losses at level 1. Oh yeah, it was awesome. <laughs> like, I... There were entire streams just... There was... Most of one stream, an entire stream, and most of the third stream where I was just on Fire Giant, pretty much. Oof, man, that was... That was a run. Let me tell you. Okay. Uh... Intelligence. I really shouldn't be putting in anything into intelligence now that, that I think about it, because if I'm going to be using the frost torch, then I'm just going to be using it to frost the enemies. Uh, whatever. We'll see. Remember, this guy hits pretty hard. Oh, I, I just missed the R2 button. but it was way too late. Dog. Ooh. Ack, how you doing?
Uh, which way? Uh, this way. I gotta run away. Yeah, it doesn't look like I'm gonna be able to stagger him because he's he's flying away too many times. Yeah, my um. My, uh, stagger meter is probably all gone. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he's flying way too many times. Should've probably went for the head there. Ooh, how did that hit me? Done. Yeah. If I get a, a jumping R2 on the head, it does like, I think, more boys damage, so going for that probably isn't the worst idea in the world. Yeah. Dog. <laughs> Whenever he does this, like, the boys damage just resets. And I don't like it. Oh. He didn't reset all the way, so that's good. You cannot repose with the torch as well. So that's something that's very unfortunate. Ooh, that was a neck shot, not a head shot. Nice. Another enemy done first try. That might have been too late. Oops. Yeah, whatever. <sighs> yeah, whenever they, they fly backwards like that, it's... If you're in the middle of an animation, then it's like, oh, well, you're... You're just kind of screwed at that point. Uh, 106, right? 106? Yeah, 106, all right. <sighs> Thanks for the GG's, let it go. You should have... Last question, what's your favorite from software game? Dark Souls 1. The one that I think is the best, though, is, is Sekiro. Um, mm, what am I... What am I uh, leveling up here? You know what, screw it, just... I'll, I'll go up to 30, uh, intelligence, I think. Probably, that was a lot more than I was expecting, in terms of runes. Uh, oops. Uh, this should give me 30? Yeah, 33. Also, you can ask as many questions as you want. I, I don't really find questions annoying unless they're, like, blatantly obvious. My favorite one is, oh, what Ash of War is that? When you can clearly see, like, the Ash of War on the left-hand side of the screen. That's my favorite one. That I... get kind of annoyed at. I'm just gonna get this first. Okay. Yeah. 
So do some of this. And let's get rocking, huh? This guy is pretty, pretty difficult for the sole fact that he's on an incline and um, the architecture here is pretty stupid to try to deal with. That was early? Kind of surprised. What? What? None of those hit. This fight is so chaotic, and it's only one of these guys, right? Surely they wouldn't put an entire, uh, entirely new fight with two of these guys in the same arena, right? Surely. <laughs> uh, first try, though. That's really nice. Elden Ring is the first from software game I played, and I was thinking <clears throat> of playing Sekiro. I don't know if I should start with Demon Souls, etc. Uh, it doesn't really matter, really. I mean, uh, if if you play the newer ones and go back to the older ones, uh, you'll see that some of the quality of life features get taken away as you go back, right? Because you know, like, there's no omnidirectional rolling in Dark Souls One, right? That, that's that's a huge one. Um, or like there's no I don't know uh, I don't know what's another simple one? like some of the upgrade systems are kind of bad right like what Dark Souls 1 and Demon Souls um, or so, like you can't you can't warp whenever you want like in Elden Ring in the other games so if they did that they definitely wouldn't give them a hard to see poison breath <laughs> that's great um, where am I going? Or what am I doing with my runes here? Um, yeah, fuck it, just go more dexterity, I guess. Uh, oh, I have to add that to the, uh, to the list. 107 bosses. Damn, dude. Oh wait, no, 108. My bad. I'm killing these guys too quick. <laughs> we gotta slow down. So, okay, so we have Battle Mage, Hughes, Left, God's Gun Apostle, Putrid, Resilient Trio, Putrid Tree Spirit. Okay, let's go to the Tree Spirit, I think. Since I definitely know where that one is. Well, I, I know where all of them are, actually, but this one's easy to get to. game in the actual map uh technically Sekiro has a map I bet you didn't know that <laughs> but yeah Sekiro has a map uh all the other ones they don't have a map all 
And then... I'm trying to think about other things that, like, are present in one game, but... They kind of improved upon it in the later games. I guess rolling in general is, is different in all the games, too. Oh, you've never played or watched Sakura. Oh, I see. Oh, okay. Wait a second. Okay. Hey, kitty. Good morning. You were on TikTok for a minute. So wait, so you left my chat a couple hours ago, and then you just came back from TikTok. That is the worst endorsement for TikTok. <laughs> yeah, join TikTok where you throw your life away. Yeah, true. Yeah, do it. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Oh, shoot. Oh, he's aiming at someone else. Wait, no, we gotta go this way, right? Bitch. Bro, did I just screw myself over? Did I just drop down the, the wrong way? Oh no. Reaper. Oh man. Uh, yeah, gotta go this way. It's 11 p.m., what the heck? Three hours? Didn't the state of Montana ban TikTok? Or they're banning it soon. Oh. They passed the law or a bill or whatever to have it banned. Pretty soon, I'm pretty sure. Is this it? Yeah, this is it. Cool. Nice. Wait, is this the wrong way? Yeah, it is the wrong way. Oops. Up number. Uh, tag. The last time you sent a message, it was. You were on there for th nearly three and a half hours. It was f four fifty-seven p.m. for me, and then you came back at eight thirteen. So, oh, almost, almost three and a half hours. <laughs> Fun fact, if you run too quickly, you can actually get hit by that, uh, tree spurt emerging from the ground. It has a hitbox, which is pretty gnarly. I, I believe these things are weak to fire.
That was very close. Stun? Stagger? Two? Stagger now? Easy. And... Done. What a stupid idiot. Trying to fight me. Alright. Uh, let's go to... Here? No, can't go there. Gotta go... I gotta go here. Alright. Uh, 109, huh? 109 bosses. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. We got less than 60 to go. GG's. Thank you, guys. Um... Okay. Is this enough? Yeah, it is. Torch is the medley. <laughs> I'm like, I'm a hundred away from being able to level up. Oh, that's right. You have your job interview today, right, Kitty? Torch is better than balls. Kitty, just remember, torch is better than balls. They'll ask you that in your, your job interview, I think. Soap and stuff? You take baths? I've, I haven't taken a bath in freaking years. You let them know that the torch is better than the balls again. Okay, cool. <laughs> um. Oh, that's a dragon. It's rough because you're not drinking, huh? Will this guy just stagger? Oh? <laughs> okay. Really hard boss, I guess. <laughs> Alright. One hundred and ten, there it is. We got uh fifty-five. Fifty-five left. Bro, do you not get any runes from that? Like I only have seven thousand. Hey, Clash. Where else do I have to go? Rising Apostle, Beastman of Missoula, and Putrid Crystallians. Okay, so I gotta go... Uh, yeah, I gotta go over here. It's comfy to have a bath and you're having a beer. Well, I mean, it can't be comfy because then you have a beer. Clash, how are you doing today, dude? How many smithing stones do I got? Alright. When's the first time you get a somber? It's, um... Crumbling Fire of Missoula, right? Estoy bien. Estoy bien tambien. Mm. 
Oh, also, hey, Swift. They don't hurt me. Uh, which rock is it? One of these rocks. This one? No. This one. There it is. Doing very well, Swift. How are you doing? Do you uh, find odd challenges like this uh, or traditional no hit more satisfying? Um, it depends. Like when you do challenges like this, it's more for a different experience, right? With no hit, you're you're mostly focused on the same thing over and over again. I mean, obviously, like with with no hit, it takes that new experience and it it moves the the um the goalpost a bit, right? Like. You're not just focused on doing the thing. It's like, okay, you've already figured everything out about like what's different about doing the odd challenge and now you just have to master it. Can I go down now? God, I forget. I don't know anything. Hey, what is this? Wait, what? Bro, am I crazy? I don't even know what that what that was. Oh, the cell in quest, okay. Wait, is this not Hey Royal Revenant? Oh, I gotta drop down a different area. Who says it's a barrier? Oh, man. <laughs> Thank you for the five gifted subs out of nowhere, Omen. <laughs> I appreciate it. Thank you, dude. This is a Wait, where am I going? I don't even know. Racism has ended. <laughs> dude, um, thank you so much. Thank you for the. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, thanks, for, thanks for the support, dude. And, um, Pluto, thanks for giving us up to Swift. Oh, guys, thank you. Racism is real. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Omen, thank you so much. I noticed you're looking, so, so thank you, dude. Fucking crazy animal. Racism punching the air. You guys don't know if you gift five subs in the channel, you can officially defeat racism. I know, crazy. Fucking crazy, dude. Just five more packs of five. <laughs>
Nice. No, you idiot. No, I hate you. Alright, good. Easy peasy. Yeah, they gotta nerf the, the torch. They gotta nerf this thing. Um, Beastman of Therm Azula is next. And, oh god, if I remember correctly, it's like, yeah, along that line. So, I gotta... I think I kinda have to go there, huh? Mandy is great. The movie? Yeah, Mandy is a terrific movie. Torches in the flame of the red mains. <laughs> You weren't a Nick Cage enjoyer. That's really interesting. Like, that movie kind of used him the way that I wanted him to, you know, be in a movie. Like, there are, there are a couple scenes where, you know, he goes full Nick Cage, right? And it works so well. Wait, I have to go down. And, but that movie rides the line of being an, like an art house movie and just being uh, something that's so hilarious so well. Like the chainsaw gag. I, I, to this day, I remember the chainsaw gag. Oi. It's a bit Oi, subtle, I guess, but. Uh, Tunico, thank you for the follow. What can I do? I have to watch Pig as well. I have it on my watch list. Yeah, Nick Cage and TBD. It's kind of sad because the leaks kind of ruined that for, um, like, as a surprise for the anniversary. Wait, is it this way? Saw dude's up toast. What are you doing today? Oh, yeah, it's over here. I forgot. Wait, no, it's not... Wait, is that it? No, wait. I can never find this place. Uh, I, I, I can never find this place. Um... Oh, let's aim throw the run. No one's gonna get through the run. Barker is one of the closest, I think. I think even he has a lot to go. I think Historian has a lot to go to. Bro, I'm going insane, right? my gameplay is fire <laughs> uh, I don't get it someone already said that it was lit so so there's that right oh, man I uh, for some reason I can never find this place is it down here it's- wait, is this it? Yeah, of course this is it. Oh god, I'm an idiot. Yeah... Hot damn, I'm stupid. Also, Mickey, how you doing? What's also funny is when Nick Cage got revealed to be a character in DVD soon, um, people were like, oh, why is it Nick Cage, right? Like, what horror movies has he been in? And it's like, 
how are you worried about horror movies? Like pretending to be a horror cinephile when you're asking that question. Alright, come on, bro. Why not, Nikki? Hey! Oh, no. This guy is just a tank? Like, th this dude has more health than some of the bosses I've been facing, dude. Jeez. <sighs> okay. Okay, I'm gonna have to go after this guy first, I think. These guys can be really bad. The thing about this fight is these throwing knives are insanely overpowered. And it, it might not look like it, right? Like, it, it, <laughs> but they do so much damage. Way too early. cheese delicious cheese <laughs> this cheese is good so much oh no you heard me That is a lot of runes that they give you. It's like, it was like 60,000 or something? 70,000? Uh, we only have one more boss in Caleb. Yeah, we're at 112. We have God's and Apostle. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's go there. Even if you lose for a while when you, uh, do you win big? Yeah, true. Whenever you go against the grain, it's, it's a safe bet, I think. Mm-mm. <clears throat> How long more stream? Uh, I'll, I'll probably be live for like another, I don't know, at least like two or three hours. At least, I mean, if I... Oh wait, I... Too busy answering tags question. Um, <laughs> uh, if I get really deep into this, then I might be able to, um... Finish it, but I, I doubt I'll finish it, though. 
Rikard's gonna be really bad. Right, Riker's gonna be really bad. I'm gonna save um, Mount Gilmere until I think the last section. Maybe I might do it before Halic Tree. Like I, I might end with Millennia or something. But. Um. Oh God, what was the direction? Are you bud? Thank you, thank you too, huh? Even though you're gone for three hours from TikTok, you want to shower, so you're going to do that. Pog. Uh, if you haven't got many points to bet, then you can't win that much. That is true. Oh wait, no, I gotta go this way. I think it's this way. You went all in? I'm going up against Godskin Apostle. <laughs> nope. Yeah, like, God's an apostle, right? And, it, the Caled one. <laughs> so, I guess, I mean, I could maybe have an okay time, but who, who knows? <laughs> I want pizza. You guys want pizza? Well, you know how it goes? Well, depending on how long your shower- Oh, I guess it doesn't take that long. Never mind. Why is Godra's Great Room just, like, the best? Ah, <sighs> dude. Um... dexterity yeah yeah okay well let's try to mess it up huh I can actually use Redon's remembrance right now you missed the DiGiorno garlic crust yeah it's a liberty you leave for a bit after the bet, all right. Pog. You have to allot the time to be unhinged. Uh, yes, Queen Slay. I'm gonna die. Oh, okay. What is this? Oh. Garbage. <laughs> uh... Where do I go now? Do I have to hop across here? Oh, I kind of do, huh? I, like, forget all about what to do here. Right. Necrodancer, what's up? Hola, bro. The fuck did you just throw? Next is back? Oh, yeah. That's right. I forgot about that. Been playing Warhammer 40k bolt gun. I don't know what that means.
Your cat was snoring? I didn't know cats could snore. That's pretty funny. Okay, what's the... What's the strat here? I guess not to die, huh? Run request? Yeah, I, I used to have a run request one, but then like... Actually doing the request is so... <laughs> I It's just so draining. <clears throat> but I mean, I might think about doing it. Again. Uh... I was thinking maybe I should use Radon's... Or Morgoth's health. I mean... Okay, I guess realistically after the first hit, health doesn't really matter. DBH. Yeah, true. Like, days for when I'm not really doing anything else. But then, like, by that vein, I should just start speedrunning. It's not, like, terrible damage. Oh, you idiot. Okay, alright. I right, see you, man. There is no torch for posts, unfortunately. That's another downside of this. No bueno. Oi, where are you off to? Pick up the phone. Is he dead? 
Not dead yet. And he's dead now. Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought I missed it. Nice. GG's, dude. Easy speezy. Well, Doubter's just kind of lost, huh? All right. Um, God skin apostle. That's all of Caleb. One one thirteen, right? Where are you off to? That is all of Caleb. Uh, Ken Patchy and friend, dude. Thanks for the follows, guys. Welcome in. Uh, so I can go into Necron. Yeah, I, I'll go there now. Why not? Will Trina's torch be resourceful uh, for any fight besides duo? Probably not. I wouldn't think of any fight that it would be good for. Uh, I get summoned here all the time by overleveled host, and this Gigachad does with the torch. <laughs> uh, Summoning the first request now. Uh, beat Elden Ring, all boss, no upgrades with inverted controls. Awesome. Okay. Um. Yeah, I'll keep it. I haven't changed my armor at all. I, I took off the the headpiece, but that's about it. I like this armor. It's the confessor's armor. Okay. Drip. Oi. Look at the drip. Uh, Umfi, thanks for the follow. Welcome in, dude. I wear the foreskin <laughs> uh, hoodie. Oh, we're lame, huh? Oh, really? Oop. Okay. All right. So the reason I came down here was... This torch right over here, right? This one. There we go. That's a beauty. Need Kitty for Gamba. Is Kitty still here? I'll uh, I'll do a Gamba for um for gargoyles, not for mimic tier, because that's cheating. Watch movie now, I'll do Gamma afterwards if uh, cringe ass streamer is still alive. Alright, don't have to be mean about it, jeez. Wait, was Gamba paid out? Gamba was not paid out. Wait, no, was it? Oh, it was, never mind. So. Will streamer first try gargoyles? Yes, he is the greatest. No, he is pee pee poo poo. Okay. He has that 30 seconds. 30 seconds, do it. Do it. Do it. 30 seconds. You're, you're running out of t 30 seconds, guys. Can Gargoyles get frosted? 
That's a good question. Can I get frosted? I don't even know. There's a rune arc here, right? Okay. The cat's having a dream, doing noises and moving its paws. It's probably finally catching that mouse it's been trying to catch for the longest. on Twitter. Dog is key parts and moves his legs while he sleeps. Really, yeah? I, I also make weird noises when I sleep. I can hear him whenever I sleep. With his foot in its mouth. Oh, man. Bro, okay, I thought, I thought this was going to be pretty simple, but geez, you just don't want to give up. Awesome. I spit on your grave. Idiot. Okay. Far in the mouth and he just sleeps. You know what? Congrats to your dog. <laughs> I can actually now um, upgrade the ghost flame torch. I should get on that actually. Because I think I could upgrade it to plus nine. I'm not sure. Um, I'm not sure if I should upgrade the Saint Trina's torch to plus nine. That's going to be a tough one to figure out. Ask Kitty <laughs> how a cat sleeps. That's pretty funny. Beast repellent torch. There it is. I might not use it for like actual combat, but it is useful for things like this. None of the rats are really gonna mess with me. Nice.
Just ask your mom how a cat sleeps? Okay, alright. Whatever, man. <laughs> First time you found this place, you were stunned. I... I kind of... wasn't like that for some reason. They already got mimicked here, right? So we have... Hot dogs are not sandwiches! 114, 114. Whoa, CBD, you can't Mickey, thank you for the 10 month prime. It's love. Thank you. I do appreciate that. I, I thank you for uh, spending your prime here. That's awesome. Enjoy the ad-free viewing. Emotes, all that good stuff. I appreciate it, dude. Should be dead, right? Torchopi. Torchopi. Look at that. They gotta nerf the torch? <laughs> <coughs> Sorry. Oh my gosh. Torch only is a neat concept. It sure is. It's really fun. I can use different torches, yes. So right now we're we're using the steel wire steer st steel wire torch is what we're using. Um, but we've also picked up uh, other torches. Actually, yeah, I should have backed. Oh, whatever. We picked up other torches as well. Um, we have the regular torch. Uh, we have the beast repellent torch. We have the sentry torch, and we have. Ghost Flame Torch. The only one that we're missing is St. Trina's Torch. Uh, you can technically use two torches at once, but it's it's not beneficial at all. According to Gordon Ramsay, if you put two pieces of bread on uh, each side of your head, you're an idiot sandwich. Therefore, a hot dog is a sandwich. What? Oh, it's not a sandwich, sorry. My bad. And then what? what is a sub? Like if you go to Subway and they, they just cut it down the middle but like not completely through? Like is, is that a sandwich? Bum 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 ba dum. First Valheim boss down. What is Valheim? <laughs> so if I put my pee pee in bread, then it's a hot dog. Then it's a sub? No, it's a sub sandwich. A sub is short for submarine. That is not a submarine. The submarine sandwich. Like, sub is the adjective. But on shorthand, you say just a sub. Oh, shoot. Why is this boss so terrible? Stagger anymore. Damn, dude. 
I got robbed. Yeah, I was worried about the one behind me. I don't know if, if there's something in their AI. But for some reason, whenever you have one of them low on health, that's the one that runs away from you, instead of the other one that's not at full health. Nice. First try, by the way. Doubters get wrecked. <laughs> nice, man. Look at that. I'm flying through these bosses. I think... Okay, I've almost done more bosses today than I did uh, our previous session. Right, so, um, gargoyles, <clears throat> that's a go. <laughs> You're welcome, Tag. Um, where are we going? We can go, well, we can't go to deep roots yet, deep root, deep root depths yet, right? Um, Mm, I, I've got the Finger Slayer Blade, actually. And then I can go there. And then... Hmm... I can do some of the underground. Like, I can go to Shifa River right now. Kill Ancestor Spirit, then go the other way. Kill Dragonkin Soldier. We'll go to Ainsel River. I might do that actually. Wait, did I actually hit it? Oi! Where are you off to? Uh Papa Pengusta, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Thank you. Thank you. Uh shoot. I need a new desk. Come to think of it. Oh wait, I have to go to EG. I'm, uh, smoking bosses with a stick on fire. <laughs> True. I'll move to the general areas. No thanks to you. Descend and make it. Yeah. You feel like Elden Ring bosses were nerfed? None of the bosses were really nerfed, though, right? Okay, so... Where's Ghost Flame? Where, where actually is it? Oh, it's in shields. I keep on forgetting. So, okay. Oh, this is a regular smithing stone. Wait, what? I didn't know. Okay. That is so weird. Why is that a regular... Smithing stone torch. It's pretty bonkers. Okay, well then. 
Uh, wait, how many do I need? Plus five, so I need six fours. And that's about it. Because I don't have the other bell bearings. I mean, like, if you have enough damage, any boss is going to be really easy, right? Well, but that's only half the, the battle. Oh, he's with stone threes. I'm an idiot. So I need six more fours and six more threes. I'm stupid. He doesn't have ability as a torch. <laughs> that is true. <laughs> I have a lot of uh, a lot of four smithing stones. I forgot. Yeah, and guys, if you are curious about what bosses I've completed, just click on that link right there. It'll take to it'll take you to a Google Sheets document. That'll show you everything. Okay. Well then, by that point, I can just upgrade that. And then I'll go get Rani's um, thing. Oh wait, no, not yet. I have to get the Finger Slayer Blade. Ugh, geez. The quest line is so stupid. Oh. Filing a lawsuit to have bosses buffed? <laughs> Your tofu nut syrup for coffee. Wait, tofu nut syrup? But well, that actually does sound like something you get from like, like a Japanese store. Tofu nut syrup. Oh, toffee. Oh, it's to okay. <laughs> like, what is tofu nut? Didn't know tofu had a nut. I saw it. It's apparently. My tofu nutted. Should I get Mimic Tear? Maybe I should get Mimic Tear and have my Mimic Tear face off against Soldier of Godric. You're dyslexic. Who asked? That's mean. It's funny, but it's mean. <laughs> oh yeah, the prediction. Yeah, thanks. Thanks for. Yes, he's the greatest. There we go. Okay. Oh wait, I have to loot the chest. Now we got Rennie's rose, right? I didn't ask why you're tofu nutted. I mean, I guess I asked about tofu nut, but then you had to go into your whole backstory about being dy dyslexic and stuff. <laughs> You'd be concerned if you saw a tofu nut. I mean, yeah, I would do. My strain, I am so I must thank you, May. It was but dude, this stupid fucking quest line is idiotic. People hmm monka hmm. I gotta go this way. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go right now.
Om. His tofu nut just soy milk. Oh man. Dude, I'm actually hungry. I'm about to drop stream real quick just to get some pizza. There's a new season of Barry. I haven't actually watched Barry. I think I watched the first two episodes at my friend's house years ago, but that's about it. See you, Numbray. Have a good night, dude. Enjoy Barry. Wait. Sorry, Swift, not Numbray. You guys both have pink names. Did I beat Morgat with the torch? Yes, I did. <laughs> uh, if you want to see the bosses that I've killed, type in the chat exclamation point uh, bosses. And a link will show up. Just click that. It'll take you to a Google Sheets that shows every single boss that I've killed. Yeah, right there. It's it's above your uh, your message. Oh, I'm surprised. Oh, he didn't see me because it's nighttime. Interesting. Okay. Alright, alright. So I can land on the button if I jump from here. <sighs> Done. Yeah, enemies have a shorter aggro radius. Radii. Have a shorter aggro radius. There we go. Um, at night. Because usually that NPC starts shooting arrows at me um, much earlier than that. Even in a building? Yeah, pretty sure. That was a nice back crack. Nice battle. Thank you? Which one? <laughs> Which battle? What's my build? Um, that's my build. <laughs> I have a torch. And... I have the charge attack talisman, ritual sword talisman to give me more damage at, at full health. I have the claw talisman, which increases my jumping attack uh, damage, and then I have the blue dancer charm. I don't know how much this actually improves my damage. Raises by seven. I mean, so it's, it's okay. I might not actually need it though. I could replace it with something else. Yeah, maybe that one. All right, yeah, whatever. Yeah, just counter attack. Okay. Oh, Risky, what's up? See you later, dude. <laughs> okay. Um, now I, I'm not sure where I want to go. Uh, I mean, I should probably just go for, um, Like the underground here, right? So I, yeah, I'll I'll go underground here. 
How long is next? It's at 3,021 seconds. So that's 50 minutes? 50 minutes and 21 seconds? It's a big commitment. Nice and swift. Hey, yo, it's Ripto. Oh, never mind. Swift, swift got annihilated. <laughs> it was just late. That's funny. You know, as I go down this elevator, I, I'll be right back. Don't. Don't murder each other, I guess, right? Maybe. Dude, I have pizza. I have I have some cheese pizza. Which I'm not gonna show you guys because uh uh I don't know. Reasons? I just found it funnier that way. Mmm, yeah. What do you mean what? I had pizza in my fridge. <laughs> I might have put it in the microwave for too long now. It's like, now it's like super duper hot. Makes you wonder, should he ever risk it and just go for the, the cold pizza all the time? No, I'll show you I'm eating pizza. Pizza. Look at that. But I hate when people look at me. <laughs> Cold
Cold pizza is so good. Depends on the pizza. Yeah, honestly, kind of depends on the pizza. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> Papa John's? No, actually. Uh, I have a niece, and they went to Chuck E. Cheese, and then they gave me the rest of the pizza. So, now I'm eating Chuck E. Cheese pizza. Ain't that awesome? How many streamers do you know are eating Chuck E. Cheese pizza? My god, this is delicious. Mm -hmm. Dude, I hate pineapple. You mean it's free? True. <laughs> free pizza is the best. Okay. Uh... I like one more bite. Um. All right, uh, bring back some ham. Okay. <clears throat> Where are we going? What are you doing? Uh, frickin' Dragon King Soldier. Let's go. Eating food thought I was a robot. Yeah, I, I almost never eat on stream. But I hadn't really eaten anything today. I ate rice <laughs> earlier today, and that's it. Don't get me wrong, rice is great. <laughs> Voice crack. Rice is great, but like. I need more. Um, I guess I'm going this way. Man. You had lasagna, yeah. dude. No brains. <laughs> Thanks for gifting Doctor a sub. I'd like to congrats on getting gifted a sub. Twenty months for the doc. Crack? Is it crack or cracked or something? I don't know if that if that command ever actually uh, got working. You don't see too many graces like this in this game, right? Because this is just a little outcove. Like you get it, and then like you you go back in. Most of the graces that you see are like along the way. That's something that they kind of shoot away from in this game. Like, they, they kind of made Grace's lead somewhere else. <clears throat> you hate rice after only eating rice for a while. Dude, I love rice. I can eat rice forever. Too poor? I can only enjoy rice? Well then, <laughs> don't threaten me with a good time. So I'm just getting hit by the rock. And I'm probably gonna get hit now. <laughs> yeah, there it is. Unfortunate. Do I not like people seeing do I not like people seeing me eat? Um I mean like if we're eating it, like if everyone's eating, then you know, sure. But like this is a this is just one angle that you got, and then, like, it can be saved online. If I'm, like, going for a big bite of something, someone's gonna, like, you know, Photoshop a penis in there, probably. Maybe something even worse, maybe a foot. That'd be even worse, actually. Uh, there's a lot of things you gotta, you gotta consider when you do things on stream, right?
you take one for the team? <laughs> Yeah, I I don't know. I mean, I, I, uh, maybe I I could just eat. And I mean, I don't even like having my mic unmuted because I know like whenever people hear other people eating, like they hate it. So I don't know. A foot with penises for toes. No, it wouldn't be that bad. Mm. Alright, cool. Cool. Gonna be getting a giant dragonkin soldier. Just plopping in. Any second now. There he is. That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Oops. I'm just trying to make you uh not kill me. Oops. <laughs> he was charging up for his ultimate and then I just... Lightly tap him. <laughs> Everything does damage except my weapon. Well, you probably... Aren't trying hard enough, is the thing. I think it's your fault. Uh, Dragonkin Soldier of Noxella. So that's 117. Damn, Daniel. Less than 50 to go. So now we can actually go here. And I'll fight the Ancestral Spear and I'll fight um, the Dragonkin Soldier down here too. You, you might think the torch is OP, but I mean, it's, it's just kind of... I don't know, dude. I wouldn't say... It. Well, you know what? I, I wonder how you would re really even compare it, because... With a plus 17 anything... Wait, this is plus 17, yeah. The plus 17 anything that has a C scaling and something, and then if you have... What, 40, 50 decks? Like, you'd be doing a lot. And Nombre is timed out for 3,023 seconds. <laughs> my, oh my. Um... Yeah, I need... I need more smithing stones. <clears throat> I believe the next smithing stones, or it's like Godskin Duo? Or the next bell bearing? It's a nice little, nice little thumbnail right there, right? I wonder how much of this was them trying to make it a, like a huge spectacle and how much of it was just for the loading screen. I could ride my horse here. You're losing friends. That was kind of a problem at one point. Like at one time, like once someone does the next and like a whole bunch of people <clears throat> do the command and then like there's no one else left to chat it's like oh, oh, oh okay all right 
streamer skills activate. You gotta keep conversation going even though there's no one in chat. Kitty, you're a mod. Get wrecked. <laughs> I hate having to do this to fight a boss, by the way. I, th I think it's so unnecessary. How do I sneeze? I don't think I saw that question. Um, I don't know. That, how do you sneeze? How do you answer that question? Like, do you want me to go in the kitchen and get some pepper? Like, induce a sneeze? <laughs> you were curling your hair. Okay, I, I sneeze. I mean, if I'm alone, I just sneeze towards the ground. Uh, if I'm around people, I sneeze into my shirt. I, I, I cover my mouth like that. Which, like, isn't... That is not as common of a courtesy as you might think it is. Have a good night, Drawlin. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for lurking. I appreciate that. Like, I remember being in high school and people would just cough openly. It's like, bro, like, are you serious? But yeah, I know your brain isn't fully developed until the age of 25, but like, man, like you, you know how to wipe your own ass, you know how to cover your own mouth. Uh, that's just what I'm saying. Oops. Would it ever sneeze into my hands? No. Absolutely not. I mean, like, if... Oops. Would there ever be a reason? I don't know. I, I don't think I would ever sneeze into my hands. No. Did they know how to wipe their You know what? Yeah, I, I should have checked, huh? If they actually knew. Uh, I don't think there was any more over there, right? I can go back. Wait, why do you ask if I would sneeze into my hands? Do you know someone who would sneeze into their hands? Cause that's like... That's like insane. No reason. I see, okay. Wait, how do you sneeze? You're asking me this question. Bro, where is... Ah, oh, whatever. Into your arm, okay. You cannot sneeze into my hands, no.
You know what? Donate more to the channel than any other person has donated before, then yeah, you can see some in my hands. Actual bet. Kitty, you're not sneezing into my hands. <laughs> Oh, you can animation cancel on that. I didn't know that. You're calling the bank. Do you know do you know what the the most someone's donated to my channel is tag? Want, want me to want me to set the stage and tell you what they did for a living? They were a crypto trader. And it was a time when crypto was booming. It was... He was a guy, his name was, um... Oh god, what was his name? Uh... Shit. It was something 808. It was, um... Wait, I'm gonna try to see if I can... Liquid Swords. Liquid Swords 808. Wait, that wasn't- that wasn't all of them? He's my Oiler? Yeah, well, so, okay, so... One day he just comes in here, because he was doing it to other people, too. He was- he was giving money to... Um... To Sun Queen. And he was giving money to, um... Prod as well. And then Sun Queen raided me. And he started giving me money. And in increments of $500 in one night, he, he donated 10 grand. Then he came back. <laughs> then he came back and he was gifting subs and gifting bits. So, yeah, he was... And then he came back into my chat once one other time to, uh, to say hi. And his way of saying hi was to just get the hundred subs, and then and 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 then he left. <laughs> I haven't seen him in over a year. Not letting Kitty sneeze into my hands is kind of fucked up. No, it isn't. No, absolutely not. Why Why would I have somebody else sneeze into my hands when I don't want to sneeze into my hands? That would just mean I would have to, like, that's more of a burden on me to go and then wash my hands like a considerate human being. Absolutely not. I would say that it is irresponsible to attempt to sneeze on somebody else's hands. Irresponsible. Unforgivable. It's for love- No, no, if I love someone, I'm, I'm not sneezing into their hands. Absolutely not. How is that relationship goals? That's just- That's no bueno. Will this guy, like, start jumping? not going down all right whatever can stagger him but it's fine dude it's fine uh where's ancestral woods there we go 
I can get down to Dragonkin Soldier pretty quick. So Ancestor Spirit. I can't use share germs. No. No, don't don't share germs on the hands. If you're hand holding, you are sharing skin cells. Skin cells are of your own person. Germs aren't necessarily of your own person. And can get other people sick. You you can't get sick from someone else's skin cells. I guess there there might be a Actually, I'm not even sure if you can get, like, skin cancer from someone who has skin cancer. I don't know, but maybe under, like, very certain circumstances. It's like a blood infusion or something, but, like... Alright, cool. Are, uh, why can't you share germs thing are of your own person? Wait, what? What? I'm confused. I don't know what you're saying anymore, Tag. Please don't die. Thank you. Thank you. Giddy up, horsey. I wonder how consecrated Snowfield's gonna be. That's a lot of damage. That was a headshot. Ooh. Stagger, all right. Got him with the the fire breather here. <laughs> nice. All right. There is a dragonkin here. Yes. Cool. So that's like. That's. All of the underground except for um, Deep Root Depths and Lake of Rot. And I feel like I should just get those out of the way. Like right now. Because I, I don't want to actually fight them later. Like, I, it's kind of a grueling thing. Uh, no, wait, not there. There's... Is that you have to you have to run or walk so far? I don't know. Fia's champs might be pretty annoying now that I think about it. <clears throat> I kind of want to kill the search tree avatar because I think it gives you a uh, pretty decent rune. Yeah. Okay. 
Oh, this guy doesn't really, uh... He's not getting really too hammered by my damage here. something right oh never mind just the staff oops oopsie daisy well then i could just ride through the the ant cave i should ride through there anyway just because they give rune arcs to you so all right Isn't this just so disgusting? Like, that's just gross. I'm just grossed out by everything? What, because I have proper hygiene? I'm, I'm not gonna sneeze into somebody else's hands? Or if someone else sneezes into my hands? Because that's not good hygiene? <laughs> that's not keeping the world safe? Bro, we just got finished with a, a, a two plus year pandemic, alright? You're talking to me about be being grossed out by things? You dingus? You ding dong? Alright, so we can't leave this area until we killed the uh, the Crucible Knight and um, Feast Champions and. Uh, oh, what's it called? Um, Fortis X. Your feelings are hurt? Good. You dingling? Unsubbed? Dang, dude. Oh my god, okay. Oops. This kill? Nice. And that's the way the cookie crumbles. Alright, um... I have to add that to my um, 
my boss list. Oops. Stay up to 4 a.m. just to be caught at dingling. <laughs> uh, that's funny. <laughs> oh yeah, in the convergence mod, that area is all like an actual area. Uh, Darren, what's up? Mm, I'm not sure how this is going to go. If he is Shemp's, just three stupid NPCs. Well, actually it's five NPCs. Suck back in the TikTok. Just delete TikTok already. There, solve the problem. How am I so smart? I mean, I I do impress myself sometimes. Lionel, whatever you say, dude. Can I make these like hit the tree? Oh, no, they just go right through the tree. Dear God. Staggered very easily. You failed step one, your dick's in the blunder. Damn, that's unfortunate. <laughs> Oh gosh. We got one. scary <laughs> he came in he came in with a jumping r2 all right jeez man 
right? I think Thea should be here. Oh, wait, no, you have to burn the urge tree. Oh, I'm so stupid. <laughs> oh, I mean, whatever. Whatever. Uh, I guess I don't really care. Um. Mm. I could increase strength. I don't know. Strength or dexterity or intelligence or vigor. Oh, whatever. Fuck it. Maybe endurance, actually, come to think of it. All right, whatever. I'll come back to Fortisex then. Um, 121? Yeah. Damn, but we made, we made some progress today. Uh, okay, I'm, wait, I'm streaming for six hours? Okay, I'll stream for a bit more because, um, I probably have to get as, as many bosses done today because Rikard might take forever. That's such a great Nodder's emote. Uh, who's here? It's the Dragon King Soldier and... What's his face? Hestel. They drink water? Yeah. Water in here. Will Sophia be like third best girl? How many... How many girls have you been track of? Oh, shoot. A saw, dude. Oh, crap. I said, I've never really gotten into that. Like, oh my god, this person's my waifu. I'm like, okay. You know what? I'm just going. I'm not going to wait for it. Time to go to bed. No, no, no. It's not happening. Don't worry about it, Yoji. Stay here. Stay here. Please watch me. Or if you're leaving, go watch my YouTube channel. You love the okay? Okay. I saw a flashing light outside my window. It's you saying hi. Can you do it again real quick? Just let me know when. When are you going to do it? Or when you already did it? Or, or something. I, I don't see it. Did Tech just lie to me? Was that, was that just lied to? Clicky click, motherfucker. Just got shot in the head. Surely that would have killed me, right? I miss it? No, no, I was... I was looking at it. I saw it out of the corner of my eye the first time, so that means the second time, if I'm prepared for it, I would have seen it out of the corner out of the corner of my eye again, so... I wasn't paying too much attention to my game. I was paying more attention to that this time around because I was expecting it. Okay, there's another flash. <laughs> there was indeed another flash. Uh, 
That wasn't you. Alright, you, you, you said you did it like a minute ago. I did it again, clearly. According to my calculations, I did it again. Ha <laughs> ha! Don't lie? Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, so... There's a... The dragon can do to you, right? Somewhere. I, I'm not entirely sure where. Um. What is this? Uh, is it straight ahead? Is it like there? Surely it isn't. Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna. Ah, oh, shit, hold on. I have to roll into... There we go. Wait, that doesn't look like the, the slow one. Damn it, dude. All right, this should be good. Oh, that was the slow Scarlet Rod. Well, that's kind of terrible. Someone's flashing. They're still flashing, dude. Alright. Morse code. It's too infrequent for Morse code. I guess I can fight him on this one. Screw it, I'll just you know, use another rune arc. Yeah, a rare death. Yeah, I'll, I'll just wait from over here.
Got his head. Why are you, like, backing up? Oh, prick. Yeah, like... What? Is there even any opportunity for me to, like, do anything? <laughs> Bruh. I'm not gonna use the, the bolus. gonna die here. Why was this easier on my level one run? I guess I, I had square off so I could I could stagger him more but yeah that's just kind of insane. Cool game. <laughs> Yeah, I would never fight this guy in a regular playthrough. I don't understand how that was a an early roll at all. What? <laughs> oh, jeez. It's maybe the most I've died to a boss so far. <coughs> and it's only because, like, if you get knocked off of a platform, like, there's nowhere to go. You you can't you can't do anything. You you can't roll to safety. You have to get rotted. That's really, yeah, uh, this, this boss is terrible. <laughs> I wish it wasn't, but alas, here we are. Now, let me get this first. Bro, why is nothing connecting? And that's another thing too, like, if- if you roll... <laughs> what? <laughs> what am I hitting? <laughs> like, what is obstructing my movement? <laughs> what is this, dude? Oh my god, this game... This game. <laughs> Alright, I, I think I think I'll save this for tomorrow. <laughs> like dog. <laughs> yeah, I'll save it for tomorrow. I try to be early tomorrow too, but like, uh, dude, I think that's where I'll cut it. Oops, there we go. Oh, jeez, okay, well... <laughs>